shit miss Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2-2. Uh, be sure to like the video. Subscribing is great as well. Buying this game, any game on the Xbox Store, the affiliate link in the video description is the way to go as it takes you to the Microsoft Store. And I get a percentage. There's also the Amazon affiliate link. And uh, consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool modes. It's a box to join for the weird money thing below the chat. And I joined a terrible, terrible match. Holy. Okay, I, I thought it was maybe not that bad. But that was bad. That was that was not that was not a good match to join. At least we got some battle pass tokens. Wait, is her name Stiletto? That's hilarious. Oh, 45 minutes of double XP? That's what I'm talking about. We stack that? I just like add that to the pile. Oh good, okay, that's that's great. And then you can just stack them, got it. Nice. So we've only got seven battle pass tokens. And then we're finished, and we could never play this game again. Just kidding. Yeah. Oh, it's nice of you to jump in. I hope you're having fun with your family on the Christmas. Bop. There we go. Uh, yeah, uh, looks like it's all running away. Right. Well, okay, good, good. It's Frosty, guys. Frosty the Snowman. Oh, the guy's got the Kringle outfit going on. Right on. But yeah, we'll do some shit miss, and then we'll go to some other stuff. I was gonna do GTA tonight, but I was just like, in a long day, and I'm like, we'll, we'll just, just enjoy some Call of Duty. I got a big day tomorrow, obviously, because it's Christmas. Well, that was a good start. That was close. I kind of wish I had ammo. Oh, we're playing hardpoint, okay. And what was it? I, I found out how to fix the black screen issue on my uh, capture card when it happens. Yeah, because there's no way I can turn my capture card on and off because it's like internal, like PCI attached. So I came up with this crazy concept that what I'll do is I'll sleep the computer awaken the computer, and then it works. Because that's kind of like turning it on and off. I was like, oh my god, that's genius. So that that actually works. I mean, I'm going to have to keep testing it to see if that's the case, but like, it actually works. I was like, oh my god, that's amazing. Because, you know, it's it's a pain in the ass having to turn the computer on and off all the time just to, you know, fix that kind of thing. But, uh, yeah, now I've got a solution for it, which is great. I'm not that close to my kill streak. I probably shouldn't be camping, but... I don't want to see if I can get a chopper. I mean, why not, right? Christmas. Why not a Christmas chopper? I love how they're giving you like little bits of cover now on some of the spots. Because it's a very tight map, so I could use that, to be honest. My only worry is, like, enemies spawning nearby. I, I think I was one away. Oh, come on. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I was one away from that. Damn, that sucks. Can't catch a break. Merry Christmas, indeed. From Scotland. Uh, yeah, so Christmas will be like a couple hours. And, you know, I gotta get up tomorrow and do it and all that. And do all the Christmas stuff. And... I'm actually trying to put together a last minute Christmas type thing. I've got, uh,. The, the old family computer, and I've got my old computer. So I'm, I'm cloning... I'm cloning the hard drive so that the old man can use the old, old computer, then my sister can get my old computer, and that there's no inconveniences for anyone. But, like, yeah, the cloning it... The hard drive is so old. And I'm taking it from, like, an old, old, like, HDDD, like an old, old hard drive, uh, to a, a NVMe drive, NVMe. I like to call it NVMe. I, I don't know if people ever know what I'm talking about, but anyways, uh, yeah. So it's 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 a four hour plus uh, transfer of the data, which is hilarious because the drive's so old. 
But then, yeah, I have to install, like, drivers afterwards, but I think I'll have it ready for Christmas. I think. Yeah, I, uh, after the stream's done, I just have to install drivers. I would imagine. And boot it and plug in all the hard drives onto the different computers they belong to. And then she'll have to buy herself Windows because, you know, she's she's getting a free computer. <laughs> Get, getting the, uh, the good old i9 9900K with the RTX 2080 Ti. I'm gonna miss that build. It was uh, it was a very very loyal build to me for for quite a number of years. So I will I will miss that computer. But it's it's going to a good home to become a League of Legends machine. <laughs> uh, yeah. So I've got that going on in the backdrop because it just runs right. It's like it's just moving the thing along. She's gonna be so blown away when like the PC just like turns on right away and she doesn't have to wait like 20 minutes for it to like boot up and stuff. But it's, it's gonna be very, very funny. Yeah, she'll, she'll get some, some good frames on Leaf now too. Because I had her on uh, my old PC uh, with a. Was it a GTX 1066 gig? I, I think was what the build was from back in the day. Yeah, because I used to have a, 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 I used to have a good AMD card, but then my AMD card died, and the only card you could buy was like Nvidia cards, and it was like a huge upgrade for me going to that. But then I did the the 2080 build, which was great, and that was another huge upgrade, and then obviously the 4090. Is it even larger upgrades? So yeah. So anyways, I'm trying to get that done. For, for Christmas, uh, I don't know if surprise would be the word. I, I, she obviously knows it's, I'm doing that, but it's just an extra thing. I did buy her a gift, too, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. Merry Christmas, folks. Hope everybody's having a good time. Have a good time with your family, or tomorrow will be. Yeah. Sounds like a good PC. Oh, I can play all kinds of stuff. How am I? I'm fine. Thanks. Hope you're doing well. Yeah. Browsing the game picks. Yeah, they added the the Modern Warfare two two characters to uh, the the pre-made game pass or not game pass sorry the pre-made Xbox uh, avatar pictures, which is I'm surprised they're allowed to do that considering you know PlayStation has the marketing rights to COD. I'm I'm actually surprised Xbox is allowed to do that at all. But um, I'm kind of hoping when this whole deal's done with Activision Blizzard that uh, they do a whole bunch of like nostalgia picks. I mean, I, I use a custom picture anyways, so I don't really care, but it would be cool if they did a whole bunch of like nostalgic COD and Spyro and Crash pictures, right? I hope they do like a huge celebration of like the history of, you know, Activision Blizzard King and they plop it all over the, you know, all over the dashboard and stuff. I actually really loved when they bought uh, Bethesda. They did a Now We're Family video. I don't know if you guys ever saw that trailer, but it was like the Xbox characters kind of welcoming the Bethesda characters, and I was like, that's that was really cool. Yeah, I, I quite like that one. I go back and watch it occasionally just because I'm like, oh, it's, it's a nice feeling. Um, yeah, so no, it's, it's going to be a nice PC. I mean, she offered me money for it. I was just like, nah, just, just enjoy it. Yeah. But it, it should be good, I think. I hope everybody in my family's uh, happy with the presents I pick out. I always feel like, you know, when I buy people presents, they never get, like, really used, if that makes sense. Like, I, I used to put, like, a lot of time into it. I put a little put a little less time into present selection nowadays, because it's just, like, you know, it rarely kind of gets used. But I, I think I got some good, some decent picks, you know, for stuff this year. I hope. We'll see how that goes. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The Last of Us Part One. Uh, yeah, that we we streamed The Last of Us Part One. Did I do a review of that one? I don't know if I did a review of the, or if I just did like a stream of it all. Merry Christmas, hello there. Yep. Say MC like Minecraft. What, what about Minecraft? So far, my PC has literally just played Minecraft for like a few minutes, just to take a look at it, and then like League of Legends to do like a video thing, just so I, I had my sister 
kind of pitch in on that. We need to do the audio stuff for it. I actually think, um, I don't know, we're, we're not doing the traditional family stuff this year. Oh, Merry Christmas as well, yeah. Little the Santa hat. Yeah, the grandparents, uh, not a little old, not in the best of health. So we're not doing like traditional stuff this year. So I think maybe tomorrow I might go and watch Babylon. I've got a run in, of engagement pass, so I think I might, uh, my sister and I might go and watch Babylon. And then we'll have like a little bit of a family dinner, I would imagine, and... What else is there? Yeah, I think that'll be about it. Hmm. Yeah, no, I think that's about it. Opening presents and stuff, too. Visited the, the grandmother today to see how she was, so... It was nice out today. Uh, we had, like, negative 40 for, like, the last week, so today was negative 10. So, you know, I brought out the shorts and the, the, the Christmas card again, and it was... It was warm. It was, like, a sunny day. It was, like, going to the beach. You know, I went to the Costco. Not to shop, because it's frickin' mayhem. But, uh, just, just, you know, grab a hot dog, uh, buy a new bottle of Kraken... Um, I wanted to get gas, but the cast line was too long. I also went to Sport Check, because it was right there. And it was like, it 40% off on stuff, but I was like, do I need more training gear? I'm like, I don't think so. I think the lights just flickered. So that's, that's, oh, ooh, lights are flickering. Ooh, the stream disconnects, it disconnects, guys. That's funny. Now no, it's done, all right. I'm hoping the power doesn't go out, because literally, the clone drive is like 80 something percent. I, I can see it <laughs> in the corner of my eye. And uh, yeah, it's like almost done. So hopefully we don't have a power issue. This is what really kills me. It's like, so they're trying to push uh, EV adoption in Canada. Like, you know, moving us all to electric cars. And like our power grid, like can barely handle our current power usage and I'm like how the hell are you gonna get everyone on freaking electric cars when our power usage is like literally I think there's 10 to 20 days a year where they're like our power grids at its maximum consider using a little less power or something and it's just like then we pay like some of the most ridiculous rates of like energy and stuff and our grid is still just like atrocious and then we're gonna have like every single car is gonna be like an electric car that's like absolute mayhem. But we'll see how it works. I mean, I'm sure they just won't plan for it and uh, everything will fall apart and we'll have to deal with it. Because that's, uh, that's Canada land for you. Are we having a windstorm? I don't think so. Merry Christmas. Hello, guys. No ray tracing for Minecraft. Uh, I didn't try it with ray tracing, but I did do ray tracing on my 2080 back in the day. Uh, but uh, I'll, I'll give it a whirl. Yeah. I don't know what the weather is. It's negative one right now. It's actually quite nice out, considering the time of day. Yeah. So, so no, so no, so no storms or anything. They actually have this thing called the Shina. It's a uh, kind of exclusive to here and now one region in like Dubai because they created the mountain. Uh, but it's a nature or natural phenomenon where, because of the mountains, there'll be these big gusts of warm wind that comes in, and it basically warms up everything. So that's how we were able to go from negative 40 to like uh, just negative 8 today. Just over like literally over a few hours just because the wind, the warm wind comes in and it like pushes all the cold stuff out. Chinooks are awesome. They give some people headaches, but uh, I don't really care. <laughs> they provide very, very nice warm gusts of wind. It is actually one of the coolest and most surreal experiences when the Chinook is happening because you can like see it in the sky and then like you can like walk outside and you just feel like these really warm wind gusts and it's like oh my god it's uh really really nice because you, you know you'll be freezing freezing and then just like warm gusts and then you'll be like oh yeah because like all the snow is melting today which if it gets cold again it'll all turn to ice but you know it's gonna probably be fine it's been a warm warm winter anyways yeah trim the tree what tree which tree christmas from florida hello there yeah, so I, I think it's by 2035, all new cars have to be electric here in Canada. We actually just banned single-use plastics, I think, two days ago, which fucking sucks, man. 
absolutely sucks. I don't know why they always just screw over the comment person. But anyways, it's that time of stream where I'm like, hey yo, like the stream, subscribing's great, donations cool, consider becoming a channel member, it's a dollar to join from the weird money thing below the chat. Alternatively, the Patreon option, uh, which is in the video description, alongside a Discord link if you want you know, to get stream alerts when we're streaming. Still streaming daily for now, as with holidays and stuff. And uh, buying this game, any game on the Xbox Store, the affiliate link in the video description takes you to the Microsoft Store. I get a percentage, it's great. There's also the Amazon affiliate link, which I'll have to go on Amazon to pick out my new monitor again for the second time this year. Go with that new PC. And for fuck's sakes, man, this is not going well. <laughs> and, uh, I don't know, what else is there? Oh, GameHardQuarters.com. Sometimes I write stuff, so, you know, that's an option there. Big chocolate fudge cake? Oh, nice. A t-shirt inside and it's cold. Uh, it's actually really, to me, it's kind of warm. I'm like, sort of sweating almost inside, but, yeah, it's, it's like only negative one. So it's, it's, like I said, negative eight today. Well, I was out and about, so it was, it was a really nice day. Yeah, I had a good time. It was it was nice out, so I figured I would go and you know go do something. Should have actually went for like a walk, I guess. That would have been nice. We got all these like Pokemon Go challenges going on, but I like walks. So. I might find a new lobby. I think our team is only going to get worse. Yeah, you ever play those matches and you're just like, your team is just not, uh, not doing well and you're like, I should bail on these guys? This, this is one of those matches. Yeah. Because that's not going to get any better. We'll do one more ship miss and I think we'll go on to other playlists. Does Amazon sell defective Series X's? I have no idea. You'd have to go and take a look, I guess. They might sell refurbished ones if that's what you mean. Yeah. Plastics were banned, yeah. So it's like they were like phasing them out, but they just they've actually like full banned them now, and it sucks because like paper straws are terrible. The bags, so I, I actually you know I, I looked this up and stuff. So for a reusable bag, to because it, it takes a lot of effort to make a reusable bag, so you have to use a reusable bag 150 times before it's neutral. Uh, for a plastic bag, 20 times is when it's neutral. And neutral means the value of the resources that went into making said item. So technically, the other, like the reusable bags, are worse for the environment from that perspective. I mean, obviously, plastic doesn't really degrade, but we do have plastic bacteria now that deals with that. And we do have allegedly plastic recycling which apparently uh plastic recycling in canada for like you know for years has just been us shipping it to like the philippines or something which is disgusting of us but yeah yeah when we we, we thought we were uh you know recycling and doing a good job here we were actually just shipping away our plastics which is again pretty disgusting for our, our government to do that but um yeah plastic bags also cost more you gotta spend like 35 to like 55 cents for like a reusable bag because nobody remembers to go shopping and bring their at least I have not really done that yet reusable bags it's uh kind of sucks it, it really does I mean it's, it's just convenience is gone I'm sure we'll come up with some kind of thing that replaces plastic and we'll figure out that that's really bad too and I don't know we'll see what happens my biggest thing though is the plastic straws it's like, is me using a plastic straw every, like, you know, a few months really that bad for the environment? Like, those paper straws are just awful, man. I hate them. I do like that we've moved to... I'm seeing some stores are going to, like, a sippy cup kind of concept. I don't mind that, but uh, I still much prefer the straw. I wonder if we'll get to a point where there's no straws. I wonder if my kids will even know what straws are. I'll have to be like, back in the day, we had this thing that was a straw. Like maybe it'll be more of a niche elitist thing to have a straw. I don't know. But anyways, those, those kind of things. All the single-use plastics are gone. It is interesting, though, seeing companies switch uh, to that sort of thing, if that makes sense. Like, in stuff that really didn't need to have plastic is now not having plastic. So that's good. That, I think, is a positive. 
But there's still like a lot of things that companies use that like plastic on plastic on plastic. And I wish the government would maybe for focus more on that as opposed to imposing additional uh, tax-like issues upon the, the, you know, the lower and the middle class is already really hurting uh, in this country over the last few years. But, you know, what do I know? I'm not in politics. Maybe should have been. Hmm. Go, go, go. Two of us? Damn it, man. Plastic works. That's what I'm talking about, a single-use plastic club on. Nipple cups like Gatorade. Well, they're like, um... They're, like I said, they're like sippy cups, where you kind of, like, bend in the top, and then you just drink it. It's not bad. They got them at Costco. I quite like them, but they're plastic. Would it arrive broken? I don't think if you buy a Xbox from Amazon, it'll, it'll be broken. Just make sure you buy from Amazon or delivery from Xbox or Microsoft or Amazon. Maple, Canadian maple syrup? Yeah, it's, um... Our, our maple syrup is, like, really good. Like, there's actually, if you guys didn't know, Canada has, like, a maple syrup cartel. Um, so it's, like, we actually control the, uh, the influx of maple syrup that exists to manipulate maple syrup prices, because there's actually maple syrup reserves. And I know that sounds utterly ridiculous, but I'm I'm actually like 100% honest on this. There's actually like, they call them like a maple syrup cartel because of how they like control that sort of stuff. But yeah, we do make uh, really good maple syrup here, I guess I would say. I hope I get to have pancakes tomorrow. Usually the family makes pancakes, so I hope when I head over there, I get some pancakes. I really like pancakes on Christmas. It's nice. Fuck, I was close to a chopper again. This is the second time tonight this has happened. I was like one or two away. Ah, oh, man. If this was kill confirmed, I would have had that chopper. Because I played the objective. Damn it, man. <laughs> I'm not kidding, man. My Xbox? Oh, Microsoft sent it to me. Blu-rays and stuff. I don't think Blu-rays will change because they're not considered single use because it's like, you know, it's like a case with a disc you mo use multiple times. I'm sure companies that have like teeth, you know, like big enough probably influence laws a bit to like what they do doesn't matter. But I, I think in general though, physical media, like CDs and stuff, uh, is kind of like getting, like, it's disappearing slowly. There is a resurgence in vinyl, but uh, I guess that's not really plastic vinyl, right? Like, it might have a plastic case covering it, but, you know, you get, like, a sort of papery cardboard-esque covering, and then you get the nice vinyl discs. So I guess that one wouldn't go away, but I, I think eventually all your media will be, like, streams or digitally available. I, I could see streaming being the focus, because they make more money off of people that way, but um, yeah, that's that's just kind of how it's going across every industry. It's a big miss, or a big push to, uh, you know, digital stuff, digital delivery, stream delivery. And I mean, that's been happening for a long time now. So I, I would imagine there's probably going to be a point where you don't buy discs. I think the funniest thing, though, is like there was all these format wars over the years. So if you don't know what a format war is, it's where there's two types of digital media, or not digital media, physical media that exist. And they compete in like, the, say, the movie industry. So there was like VHS, and there was Betamax, and there was like Laserdisc, and there was, uh, oh, what the hell was the other one that went up against Laserdisc? Mm. Anyways, there's different formats that win. So like, obviously, VHS, you know, beat out, like, Betamax and stuff, and Laserdisc wasn't huge, and, uh, Blu-ray beat out the HD DVDs, and, uh, it, it just kind of, it's funny, and it sort of sucks for Sony, is they ended up winning the, the format wars, you know, with the Blu-ray and the 4K Blu-ray, because that's theirs, that's their proprietary technology, 
but they won in a time where it's like the format is is like dying if that makes sense like you know obviously there's still a lot of games that all run off the the blu-rays and there's lots of movies that still get released but you know the potential profit is like infinitely lower because people don't really buy physical copies these days right Hell, I think was it Xbox and PlayStation? They're getting up to 70% digital market share this gen. So, you know, it's it's on the way out. But it, I, I'm sure they're kind of pissed off because they're like, we finally win the format wars. Because no one's interested in competing anymore. And it's like, and we're basically at a, at the twilight years of the physical media. It's just like, you know, if you run like a cable or a satellite, that group. You know that you're in the twilight years of like people using satellite and cable, you know, they've all kind of moved on basically and there's all the cord cutting, right? But uh Yeah, and then they try to the funnier thing is the cord cutting happens and they make the prices more expensive and they push more commercials and they make it worse and then you know eventually the industry just dull is <sighs> laser disc. Oh DVD, DVD went out really well. Yeah. When Xmas Day? I mean, it'll be when I go to bed and wake up in the morning. Do I like crumpets? I, I don't know if I really care much for crumpets, to be honest. I don't know if I've had, like, a really authentic crumpet, but... Yeah, I, I, I don't know if I'd call them the same as, as pancakes either, though, personally, but, you know. Oh, hi, Stu. Merry Christmas, indeed. You want to celebrate Christmas? Oh, oh, well. You got a Series X as a gift? Oh, that's nice. It'll be a fun one, though. Oh, John, Merry Christmas as well. Hello there, hi folks. Yeah, so everything's crazy. What color is the sky? Usually blue. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. I always thought that would have been funny, was just doing like politics. I actually probably would have been pretty geared for it. If I get people in the room, I can be pretty charismatic. I always said that's my biggest issue, is like getting people in, and then once people are in and interacting with me, they usually like me to a degree, or, you know, whatnot. It's just getting people in that's always the problem, but I thought I could have done politics, or could, I guess, at some point. Christmas crackers? Oh, yeah, we still got the snowflakes crackers. I've been enjoying the last few nights after the streams. I've got, like, the Ritz snowflake crackers. They're on sale because they're clearing them out. And, uh, yeah, and then I've got, like, a selection of meats from Costco, like, little sliced meats, and then a selection of sliced cheeses from Costco, so I do, like, some meats on the cracker with the cheese. Very good. Very, very good. Yeah. It's a bit too much food for me. I feel a little sick going to bed, but uh, it's good. Congrats on winning. 2021 versus now? <sighs> in, in what way? I don't know. Um... Let's see, uh, YouTube growth was good, business stuff was good this year, uh, personal stuff not as good this year, and uh, I don't know, it's kind of another year of living, I, I guess, nothing too exciting. Hopefully 2023 is more magical, but I don't know. Like I, I say often, I'm in this weird gap portion of my life where I'm just kind of working towards making enough money to move on to my next portion of life, which is uh, buying a house. So I'm just, uh, again, saving, saving, saving. And I should, after next year, barring some kind of crazy thing, have a very, very good down payment, if not actual, being able to grab a house property if house prices uh, do drop like they are supposed to. So, hopefully, probably early 2024, I could have a nice house that I own. Most of it. You know, I'll have like a mortgage, but I'll, I'll have like a healthy, healthy chunk of, of down payment. Essentially. I'm hoping, you know. I mean, who knows, maybe the YouTube won't be very popular next year. I'll make no money and I'll be like, oh, sad. But, uh, yeah, hopefully it grows. I mean,. This year, my big issue was no games releasing. Next year has lots of games, so I hope that helps. And we'll have to wait and see uh, what happens. You know? Like I said, I can't control things. It's just like I put out content, and hopefully people like it. And uh, yeah, that's, that's about all I can do. That's life. 
the Santa hat all year long? No, no, no. The Santa hat vanishes after Christmas. Well, actually, I think I usually do it till New Year's, but yeah, the Santa hat. So it's time is almost gone. Feels very holiday cookies. Oh, those are good. Is Zaddy coming down the chimney tonight? Who's to say? I love the wrist snowflake crackers. They really do uh, bring me great levels of cheer and enjoyment. They're just salt. Like, high levels of salt, basically. But they are absolutely delicious and festively shaped. And like I said, you get them like for really, really good deals because they just clear them out because they're like a very seasonal thing, right? Oh damn it, he drop shot at me? I didn't even notice him down there. I always find that funny when people drop shot you and you don't even like notice them. Like I have people like that drop shot me from behind all the time, but I'm just like, what are you expecting me to do? Like run around and shoot you? you could have just been standing. Some people kind of take it a little too seriously. I mean obviously we're competing and stuff, but like Yeah, I, I do find that some people are a little a little too hardcore about it. It's like we're in the big leagues of like esports. Which reminds me, because we haven't talked about that in a while. I'm really hoping we get some kind of really cool hybrid esports thing from Microsoft when they get Activision Blizzard bought because uh, MLG comes with it and they own Smash GG that they changed to start not GG, so I'm thinking they might merge that and then we'll have like a cool esports type backbone with all the different you know, properties they'll own, because they also, they got like the COD, you know, eSports, COD League, and they can combine that with like the gear stuff, and, well, they shut down the Gears League, but I mean, they could like bring that back up again, and combine it with like the Halo Champion stuff, and they have like a big Xbox eSports effort, if they put in the effort, it would be kind of cool and neat to see. Yeah, see MLG get back to like its prime or something, it would be interesting. Yeah, and I mean, if they bought Netflix, which is kind of my next Microsoft purchase pick, like if Microsoft buys Netflix, they could like integrate MLG into that, and you could like stream in the different con. Like you could be watching Netflix, and it'd be like, oh, there's a Call of Duty tournament going on, and you could like stream watch that. That would be really interesting for integration. I guess. Hmm. You know what I mean? That would actually be quite interesting. Because I also think it's smarter to have all your stuff in-house instead of shopping it out. Is it just me or am I dying a lot over and over again because this freaking team just sucks? I was doing decently well. I was like VTOL and everything. Kind of like spawning and dying or something. For God's sake. Can you join? Of course. Chicken steak pie chicken? With steak in a pie? That's crazy. Steak in a pie. That's almost two bowls. I'm thinking I should give up on this lobby. I think the tides have turned and we're not going to be able to come back. I was doing alright until my teammates basically were feeding the other team, like it's like League of Legends stuff or something. You know what I mean though? Like they just gave him all these kill streaks because our teammates suck. Damn. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave. It's a loss. I know when to leave now. I, I know when it's not worth it. I'm hoping to hit level 200 tonight. I'm at 198. I've got the double XP on. And then, because I have a battle pass unlocked, a token unlocked that's not showing, because then we got that and that, so that'll give me two, and then I only need five more, and this battle pass will be done. So probably next stream we'll finish the battle pass, I think. A new dynamic theme for Pentiment. I thought there was a- is there another Pentiment theme? I quite like the one that they added. And State of Decay too. Cool. Yeah, I like the dynamic themes. I wish they did more. Well, yeah, I was like in a match. You gotta- you gotta keep trying and wait for a spot to open up and stuff. Yeah, the lobby's probably just full. It happens. We're taking Charlie. Yay, we get to play on this map. I love this this hotel level so much. Brings me great joy when we get to play on it. 
great, great joy. I see a lot of those guys in the Santa Claus outfit. But I gotta say, I, d I don't think I've seen an operator or an operator skin yet for this game that's been like truly successful. You know what I mean? Like when you played Vanguard or like Cold War, like in Vanguard, the Snoop Dogg skin was everywhere. And when you played Cold War, the, uh, what was it? The John McClane and the Rambo skin. Those ones were everywhere. But I haven't seen that yet for this game where they've got like a skin that's like truly, you know, you see it in every match. I see like the Kris Kringle one seems to be the most common, but yeah, I've yet to see one that's got like full market penetration where there's like a ton of people using it, if that makes sense, yeah. Merry Christmas. Is there anything new in the store? Oh no, we can check it out next time. Oh, so there's another theme on top of that. I really like Pentiment, uh, especially for like little themes on the dashboard. They, they got some nice little designs. I think the first one with like the little like waterfalls and stuff was quite nice, because that's like a scene from the game. But my thing is like, why don't they have more like dynamic designs? Like if anything, they should have like a creator space where you can like make dynamic designs and sell them or something would be neat or I, I don't know it just it seems like there's like a very limited uh, selection of designs I think it was a while ago that on the Windows Store it leaked that there's like a design builder that's available and it looked kind of cool I think it was like Windows Central did a big write-up on it and it's like a very easy way for them to just layer images and like you know like gifs and stuff and make designs so I was like why don't they just open that up and we can make our own or like you know, it's sort of weird because in the 360 era, you know, they used to sell like gamer picture packs, they used to sell dynamic like themes, and it's like nowadays they don't do anything like that. It's probably leaving a lot of money on the table. It's just saying, yeah. The Leatherface one. They also did uh, Scream. Scream was really, or, sorry, Ghostface from Scream it was really popular. That was big. That was like the Mortal Kombat 2019. Well, I think it was like a Warzone character skin. Is where that one was introduced, right? Because you could like call the phone and it'd be like those days, yeah, that kind of stuff. That was really popular. But my big thing has always been like, I know they do a lot of original, you know, operator skins, but why don't they do more tie-ins? They're probably leaving a lot of money out on the table. Because I thought Vanguard had actually like a pretty lackluster selection of, you know, tie-ins. There was like, what, Godzilla, Kong, Mechagodzilla, and like Snoop Dogg? I, th I think that was it, right? Were like the tie-ins? And I'm just like, you guys are leaving so much potential money on the table by not doing more. Because I think the, the early leaks said they wanted to do like Indiana Jones and like Captain America, and I was like, phew. I'd, I'd buy Indiana Jones and like Captain America skins. Yeah, it's not like they're not making money off that crap. Hmm. Uh, I think our team's at a disadvantage this match, too. I did join in progress, but it's like, uh, it's kind of hoping that we can turn the tides on this great level. So I'd love me some hotel. You know, I'm starting to think that museum map's not coming back. How's the camp grind? What the? Oh, there's only one Pentiment theme? Yeah, okay, fair enough. Well, it's, it's nice when people let me know about things. Oh, the camo grind. Oh, um... I'm, I'm finished grinding camos. I, I got all the platinum stuff I, I want and I need, so I just, uh... Yeah, I just have fun using this gun. <laughs> If I, if I ever f have the feeling or the need to grind camos again, I do now have a ton of weapon XP tokens, which will be super helpful, but yeah, I'm not. I don't have any desire to, to grind out any more camos. I've, I've got what I need. I'm, I'm satisfied with what I have. Yeah, very, very satisfied. I'm fulfilled in that regard. It's nice when you can be fulfilled in things, you know what I mean? 
Anyways, it's been a while. Be sure to like the stream. Subscribing's great. Uh, donations, cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool emotes. It's a buck to join. There's channel member gifting if you want to do that. Uh, there's also the Patreon option. Buying this game, any game on the Xbox Store. The affiliate link in the video description. There's also the Amazon affiliate link too. Exciting, right? We're losing Bravo. But, uh, yeah. The gift of channel membership. Or whatever. You left a party? Oh, did you find another Christmas party? Is my party private or open? It's always open. You feel like you're... Max level is 250. Oh, I know. I'm, I'm gonna reach the battle pass cap before... Like, I, I don't care about the level cap, I just care about finishing, like, the battle pass, and then I don't really have a progressional thing to work towards. Yeah. Then I won't know what to do, we might not stream this one for a bit, because we'll wait till the new season's out or something, or maybe we'll do, like, Warzone or something like that. There'll be new games coming out uh, before this battle pass is uh, wrapped up in, like, 30-something days it's got left. So January we'll have new stuff to do regardless. There'll be new games. I'm really hoping that Age of uh, Empires is really, really popular, and that I could do like a bunch of streams of it. it is kind of my like real hope on that. Uh, yeah, that's really, really what I'm kind of hoping is that one is super popular, and then I can just play the hell out of it because I, I love Age of Empires too. And it would be great to have an excuse just to sit there and just play a ton of it. Because like I said, I want to do uh, a stream where we have like Kevin in and we just do like a long, large Age of Empires 2 skirmish match and like, I think that'd be a lot of fun. Yeah. I think that'd be a blast. New Year's, it would actually be interesting to do like a Christmas Eve party, but usually I just do like family type stuff for Christmas, things like that. Yeah. I gotta decide what I'm doing on New Year's. I'm probably just gonna stream. I don't think there's really anything too exciting to do. I'm not a party monster like our pal Joel there. And the last day of Wine Mist, we've got the Crush Riveneer, so a little, little disappointed that it's a, a white wine to end the uh, the event on, but you know, better than nothing. A lot of, lot of white wine, not a lot of uh, red wines, which I was like, oh, okay. I like my red wine. Uh, but this brought me up to 71 different wines on my little review wine list, so I'm probably going to get to 100 wines after next year, I think. Yeah. If I ever become popular enough on YouTube and I get more free time, I'd like to become a sommelier. That would be a fun side activity to do in life. Yeah. Dead Rising 2 to 100% on the 360. That's interesting. We started uh, Dead Rising 2 play on stream we'll have to go back to that again at some point uh, and finish it off because i think we were like halfway through i believe yeah i think we were halfway through on that one it is actually hot tonight i'm like sweating check the store oh yeah okay let's let's take a look overgrown 2 this is a great deal so it's like 13 canadian but you get 2200 cod points and like 2200 cod, like 2400 cod points i think is like we did the math on that one sorry let me take a look at this so like 2400 cod points is 27 dollars canadian so you get 2200 plus some items for 1340 so like half off i'm really really tempted to buy it i'm like i don't need more cod points because as you can tell i got 7500 off 7900 by the time i finished the battle pass but like it's a really good deal, you know what I mean? Like a really, really good damn deal. Yeah. Yeah, f f physical fights are, are never worth it at all, in my opinion. Uh, I think a lot of people really lack uh, pushing for diplomacy and whatnot. I mean, sometimes you have to defend yourself in life, but like, you know, I, I do quite believe in diplomacy and talking things out with people and not, you know, doing stuff like that. 999 USD, so there you go. But that's what I'm saying, is like, I actually might buy that. I might pick that up, and then, uh, Alan Wake Remastered, I'm gonna grab two. And then we'll do a, a stream play of, of Alan Wake as well. There's a few games I want to do stream plays of, and then, like I, like I was saying the other night there, I want to remove some of their 
walk through playlists that are like 20 something videos. Because I was like looking at removing the. Was it the Blood Forge walkthrough? That's like 26 parts, but I'm like. I kind of looked it up and then there's only two people out there that even have like a walkthrough for that game. So I'm kind of like. I don't know, for prosperity, it's, it would kind of feel bad removing that, because then there just wouldn't be anything covering that game. And I actually think it's kind of a cool game, so that would be sad to me. But I am looking at cleaning up some stuff. Oh, guys, look, the, the hard drive is closed. Well, I mean, I guess you can't see it, but uh, the computer is rebooting itself because it cloned the uh, the hard drive, so it's done now. Awesome, okay, so that's good. Then I can download drivers, and then that computer is ready for my sister for tomorrow. Boop! Got it done. Sky Claws delivering. Hostile UAV in the area. Probably get some like real sarcastic response from her about getting it all set up too. Uh, is what it is. Anyways, it'll be cool. So does it turn itself back on or is it just turned off? I think it just turned itself off. Is it gonna turn back on? No. Okay, it's, it's, it looks like it's just sitting there. That's fine, I'll turn it back on later and uh, download, because i got to download the drivers and everything for the, you know, for the graphics card and everything like that. Get everything downloaded. It's a lot of work. <laughs> PC setup stuff. I've, I've been really tired too, because I had to get my PC all going. And then I'm getting that PC going, and then we'll be, well actually I don't have to get the third PC going, so the third PC will just work as is. But hers, she'll have to buy Windows, and then, yeah, I'll have to get all the drivers downloaded so it functions. That's a teammate. And it should be good to go, yeah. PC work. I also had to help Kevin tonight uh, troubleshoot. He got a, uh, a blue screen on his computer, the blue screen of death. At first I didn't know what he was talking about, because he's like, my PC said it got an unexpected error and had to restart. And I was like... Yeah, I, I think I've had that message a few times. And then I looked it up, and it's like, you know, I Googled it. And I'm like, oh, it's the blue screen of death. Because I've, like, I've never called it a, your PC has an unexpected error. It's always the blue screen of death, right? And he doesn't know what a blue screen of death is. So I had to teach him that. And I guess he didn't, um, he doesn't know what drivers are. So I had to teach him how to update his graphics card. Because I guess he's never updated his graphics card before. So I'm hoping that fixes this issue. Yeah. So, anyways, it, it's very, very funny when he, because he always asks me questions about, like, how his PC is supposed to run. And it's just, like, it's stuff I think you should know, but I'm like, he wouldn't know because he's never had a PC before. Yeah. You don't buy a ton of coins, you just save and gain currency, right? That's kind of what I got to go in there. What was that sound? Uh, I, I don't know, it might have been a game, a good game sound. You're buying that, that's a good deal. Use the affiliate link! But, uh, yeah, it is a, uh, it is a hell of a deal there. Um, buying that pack, because it's, it's literally half price, right? Like, for coins? It's, it's literally half price. It's a very, very good deal. That's his charitable of Activision gets over the holidays. The hell was that guy? There's another guy in there. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Come on. Ah, uh, where did this guy go? Of course, he's still there. 360 games? Your cousin refuses to buy a new Xbox. Try to get them there. Uh, yeah, I don't know what that's like. Might have been the PC turning off, but I doubt it. So it's probably just an in game sound. You guys ever hear that sound that the game makes occasionally where it goes like bloop bloop? before like a match starts, I'm always so confused about what that is. If anyone could figure out what that sound is, that would be so helpful. It's like a bloop bloop sound, and other people have heard it too. So I'm not crazy. It's weird. Oh, 
Oh. It's actually a good spot to camp. I've, I've never seen somebody in that area before. Got me good. Got me good. But yeah, I hope everybody has like a, you know, nice Christmas surprises, gifts and stuff. Now, I was talking to like uh, my mama there and she was like, I've got something really, really surprising for you. And I was like, oh, that's cool. You know, I'm, I'm old now, so I don't expect any like really exciting gifts. I asked for socks. She said she wasn't able to find socks for me. I should settle for Puma socks. And I was like, no, I want, I want the socks. I like. So, I have to go find socks, I guess. Believe it or not, Nike socks are very hard to find. For whatever reason, they're constantly a rarity where I live. I, I don't understand why. I go to multiple different stores. And it's like, there's always Nike socks shortages. At least for the socks that I use. It's bloody weird, and they're expensive too. It's not like they're cheap socks or anything. But anyways, yeah, she's like, the, we, we couldn't find the socks. She was using my sister to help, and I was just like, oh, that sucks. But uh, yeah, apparently there's gonna be a good surprise. So that'll be fun. We'll see what it is. Uh, Alan Wake? Oh, Alan Wake is so good. It's one of my favorite games of all time. Usually fully link. Well, you know, I gotta, I gotta, gotta get my money. It was with Stu. Stu uh, bought that pack, and he used the fully link for it. You know, gotta, gotta, gotta take my bits when I can get them, right? You know, you know what I'm saying? It's like, I, I need money. You know? like, I can't buy a house without, you know, lots of currency and stuff like that. That'd be so cool when I buy a house. <laughs> it's gonna be like a. A level of like loss of cash that I've never experienced in my life. It could be worse though. It could be like one of those guys that like has all the stuff in crypto and it all, you know, you lose it all or something. That would that would be bad. At least, at least when you're buying property, it's like value, right? Okay, that was really sketchy. How he was able to look back and then somehow look forward. You see this? Does, does that look unnatural to you on that one? Right? That's weird. Remnant 2? Uh, I don't know. Was there a date for Remnant 2? At, at the Game Awards, they showed a surprise trailer for Remnant 2, so that was surprising. But uh, maybe next year? I don't know. Really not too sure. But I, I will have some fun surprise videos for you guys tomorrow. You know, I, I always like to deliver a fun holiday video, so I, I think you guys will quite enjoy uh, the morning video. And then the afternoon video is just uh, Game Pass suggestions for the month. Because I, I figured with new people buying a console for the first time, that they might be looking for Game Pass games to check out, so I thought that was a good tie-in day for it. But uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy the morning video. I, I think it's kind of fun. It's a little bit out of the blue. I mean, if you were here last year, it won't be too surprising, but it was, it was a fun little thing. Yeah, I think it'll be entertaining. And then I was glad the GTA video did decent today, because I wasn't sure how that was going to go. Because I didn't know how exciting it was, but it was like a snow. Game. What else did I do today? It was GTA and, uh, oh, Spider-Man on the Series X. Yeah, that was, that was okay, too. Yeah. So anyways, uh... Lots of good stuff to come. You know, I've got some good videos planned. I uploaded a bunch of, like, retro videos today as well that you won't see for a while, but, like, The Godfather on 360, Metal Bonner Warfighter. Um, yeah, because I had the 360 on to, to shoot some stuff, so I was shooting some more retro videos and, that, you know, for fun little mixins. Did I enjoy Elden Ring? Um, hmm. That's a really hard one. If you watch my review, I'm like, it's it's a very hard game. I would say that overall my experience with it was positive. I see why it's so well loved to the degree it is. I do think it definitely did deserve to be the year this year. But it's like, the question of if you should buy it really comes down to, did you like Dark Souls? Can you handle a Dark Souls-like game? They've made it a lot easier to play. Uh, since launch, they've done a lot of updates to make it a lot easier to play. But it's it's also like, you know, just keep in mind that it's not like an easy game, it's not like a fun game. But if you do like that style of play, it's Dark Souls Open World, so I think you can quite enjoy it if you're into that type of game. 
So just keep that in mind. It's, it's like, it's not for everyone, but if you do like that type of game, you will love uh, what it has to offer for you. Filet left. Was it too hardcore filet? Mm. Hook up your 360. Yeah, I've got a couple more games. I want to do a PGR3 film and a The Simpsons game, and then I think I'm done with 360 games that I own that I can do a video on. Yeah. I've got a couple of original Xbox games I picked up that are quite rare, but like they're not backwards compatible on the 360. So it's like a little hard to do those. I'm thinking of maybe doing some like emulated type stuff PC-wise for original Xbox games, because I think that might be cool. But there's all these legality things I have to deal with. So I'm kind of like really debating on you know, some, like, light extra content for next year, how I'm going to do that. So stay tuned. Because I can't really film, like, the original Xbox. I've got, like, a crystal original Xbox, but it's, like, it doesn't have an HDMI cord. So I'd have to buy, like, a, a converter cord. So, like, I don't really, like, I'd have to look at the pricing and all that. But I'm, like, it just seems like it'd be a lot more effort than it would be worth it. So... That's that's something I'm investigating for next year. You love Demon and Dark Souls. Okay, yeah, well then you, you'll, you'll like Elden Ring. It's, it's the same as that. You, you'll like it then. Yeah. I think Filet got frustrated. What was that command we have? Is it Phil? What was the command? Oh, let me take a look at this. Ah. Why do I want to type that in? It does like, oh my god. Fish? Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. Yeah, no, it was hella frustrating, but they, they've made it a lot easier. There we go. Now now I got the skybar command. I couldn't remember what the term thing was. <laughs> Licking my wounds after Callisto Protocol. Like I said, I've had like a really rough, like a personal emotional here this year. And like some of these games have just been brutal. She has a brutal on top of that. There's something like feeling really bad and down and then like trying to whip yourself up into shape to like do a live stream and try to like entertain people. And then you play something like the Callisto Protocol or Scorn or Gotham Knights and it just like beats your ass down and you're just like, oh my god. It's like a, you know, Bane there in The Dark Knight Rises where he's like, you'll punish bit most people will severe. And it's just like, oh, and I go to bed, just beat. Like, I remember finishing Callisto Protocol, and I just wanted to die. I was like, this this is how life ends. I was like, that was that was just brutal. It was a long stream. And it was just a painful ass time. Absolutely painful. So I'm, I'm looking forward to not having to play that game again for like a very very long time like obviously when a next gen xbox console comes out i'll do a video revisiting callisto but like, yeah and apparently it's easier now because they made the reloading and the gun switching actually like usable and they made it so you can heal actually like an actually heal now so so that should be nice but uh yeah there's there's nothing like just being beaten emotionally down and just tired and exhausted and doing a stream and just like several hours of this game just freaking beating your ass into submission it's it's traumatizing yeah the iphone 14 for christmas oh that's nice i hope you enjoy that if you haven't had 5g before it's uh, very very fast it's it's great took over achievements must be playing an easy game I did, I got uh, my ID, like I'm back on the ID at Xbox list, so they send me weekly, you know, Xbox games, like all the games that come out through ID at Xbox, I get every single week just sent to me automatically. It's great, you know, because it allows me to sit there and look at like all the games, you know, not like AAA, just ID at Xbox titles, but it allows me to sit there and look at the games and be like, okay, you know, what is there worth doing a video on to show you guys? What are these games? Like, which of these games are worth doing something to show you with, right? It, it helps me do my work really, really easily. Because I don't have to email the individual companies. You know, I don't have to, like, message all these different people and be like, Hey, can I get a code? Or who can I message to get a code? And blah, blah, blah. It just comes to me in an email. So, 
that's kind of what I do. Is, is sometimes there's like really really easy games you get achievement from, so I just turn those on, and that's probably how I passed you. There was uh, Kuki Search and Find. I'll show it after the match. It was actually a fun little game. I, I actually really really enjoy these games. It was kind of like a Wiggers Waldo kind of game, and I got all the achievements in like I don't know five minutes or so, ten minutes. I was so close to a chopper again. Fuck you, man. Uh, anyways. So there was that one. I think there was another easy one for achievements. So oh, the pedestrian. Uh, there's like a debug. You can search the video online. There's like a debug uh, way to get all the 1,000 gamer score in five minutes. And that's a Game Pass title too. So I didn't even download it. I just uh, cloud streamed it. <laughs> and I uh, got all the achievements in five minutes. And I was like, woo! So that was good. It's also never a bad time to like the stream what crazy subscribing's great uh, donations do consider becoming a channel member cool perks cool votes it's a buck to join there's also channel member gifting which is cool you're buying or there's a patreon option buying this game any game on the xbox store the Philly link in the video description takes you to the Microsoft Store. I mean, you're buying it digitally anyways. Might as well support the channel. I get a percentage. Blah, 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 blah. And there's also the Amazon store link if you're buying anything on Amazon. Which I have to, I think. Maybe not tomorrow. I, I won't deal with it. But over Boxing Day, I need to pick out a new monitor. Because if you guys didn't know, I bought a monitor through Amazon. And they... When it came, it was a used monitor, so I had to send it back. And then, like, now I have to buy another new monitor, and blah, blah, blah. It's exhausting. It's just like, honestly, this year has been like one issue on one issue on top of another issue, and then all these other problems, and it's just tiring. Yeah. And a lack of games, so I'm kind of a little bored, because I haven't had any stuff to really play. If I have work to do, you know, I'm busy, I don't have to think about things, I can work, but it's just like, when there's not, it's, it's terrible. Like, just imagine you doing your job, but it's like completely mundane and it's automatic and everything, you know, you just do your basic, whatever, and it doesn't take up much of your day. And it's just like, you don't deal with anyone, really, you're just tired. That's, that's literally a year, basically. Well, not a full year. I was pretty busy up until April, I think. The pedestrian is leaving. Oh, it's leaving? Oh, wow, you should go get that done then. Oh, that's what I was talking about, Sarcassi. They, they did a full update that made, like, healing and everything better for that one. The DLC for Remnant? I mean, if it goes on sale, go grab it. Let's <laughs> do with Gotham. Gotham was, like, aggressively okay. I don't know. You know, I, I probably would have given it like a 5 or something. I, I still haven't done a written review for it. If I have time, I'll do a written review. Like today, I, I slipped in a little bit of time to do one written review. Uh, it was like a Playmobil Knight Rider set, which is awesome. But like, I've been really putting that off for months. And I was like, I needed to get it out of my room. So I, I kind of cleaned up a little bit today. You know, my work area. Because I've been really lagging on that. It's not finished yet. But like... You know, I've been cleaning up the workroom a little bit more, because I got, like, there's more space taken up, because I brought in the big, you know, because I got all the PC parts in a big box, and I gotta, you know, put that in, like, a closet, and I gotta combine all these PC parts so there's too much space. You know, there's a lot of boxes that were around, but I was like, I gotta get this Playmobil set done and out of here, so that I can focus on other stuff, and that was, that was what I did today. Quick Playmobil review. I also rendered and uploaded like five or six videos that you'll see, you know, in the future. But you know, that was that was just the usual work stuff. But like I said, I want to do a Godfather live stream on the 360. It's actually awesome. <laughs> like I forgot how fun that game is. So I want to do a stream of that one. That's that's in the cards, guys. It'll be weird. We've, we've never done the stream like that, but it'll, we'll be doing it. <gasps> Filet became a channel member. What is this Christmas? Whoa! You'll see me, you're leaving because the, the skill based matchmaking has killed you. Yeah, that happens a lot to people. I, I get it. It, it can get frustrating and stuff like that. The thumbnails? Oh, I'm, I'm glad you enjoyed that. They're supposed to be eye catching because then you hopefully come and watch the video, so I'm, I'm glad you like the thumbnails. I do actually spend uh, a fair bit of time, uh, like, on. A, a thumbnail, if that makes sense. 
like I try to um, what was it I, I, I try to like make them like I have like a branding thing believe it or not so like uh, I, I try to do like I've, I've done a lot of research into it and I try to do a psychological thing where it's not like branded where it's like hey this is my channel thing but like kind of like that icon you can kind of like know what it is and you can know that's like psychologically my stuff and then like you know the big image art and stuff I, I, I actually try pretty hard on the thumbnails so I'm, I'm glad you you know find them a little a little enticing at least because I, I do spend time on that so thanks that's that's nice to know fillet of fish did Filet do a gifting? Oh my god, it is Christmas. There you go, guys. I think all the memberships were gifted. Wow, look at Filet there being all generous. Thanks for gifting channels. Or channel. Thanks for gifting memberships to people, Filet. <laughs> That's funny. The gift of Christmas. And, uh, yeah, very, very generous by, uh, by Filet there to, to do that. Gotham Ice was kind of fun. That's what I'm saying, is, like, it was, like, really, like, the performance wasn't really, I don't know how to describe it. Like, the performance wasn't really great on Gotham Nights, and the world was, wasn't really exciting, so it was, it was a really, like, okay kind of game. You know what I mean? It's gonna be one of those awkward games though that they never do like a next next gen upgrade on or they you know just kind of gets forgotten about I'm, I'm kind of thinking it's gonna be the case but like it was really just ugh. like it wasn't good but it wasn't like terrible terrible garbage but it was like pretty kind of in the middle it was, it was more disappointing than anything it was very nice that our one uh channel member uh Sorensen gifted me that game so that I could check it out and stuff. So that was very kind of him, because he was curious about my thoughts on it. So that was very, very generous. Yeah. The gifting thing? They did. They they did some new updates so the gifting thing actually gifts properly. Yeah. So congrats on those that won, won channel memberships. I hope you enjoy it. Mm. How was my day? It was okay. Uh, like I said, it was it was sunny today. It was nice. I wasn't wasn't sunny, but it was like from negative forty to negative like eight. So you know, it was like shorts <laughs> for me weather. And I went out and had a Costco hot dog, and um, yeah, it was just, just kind of a nice day. Yeah, it was good. I hope everybody else had a good day and getting ready for Christmas and all that good stuff. Yeah. I also decide after the stream if I want to sit there and edit uh, oh, my bad guys. If I want to edit, like I got a Minecraft uh, Christmas present sent to me, so I'm like, I filmed it a while, like a few days ago, but I'm just debating if I want to like edit. I think it might be a short I might put together for it, so we'll see if I'm in the mood to get that ready for tomorrow too. But we'll see. Level 200 guys. That means I've unlocked. A battle pass token that's not showing up. So I've got like I think three battle pass tokens. So that mean I need four more, and then I've finished uh, the battle pass. Oh, <gasps> right near the end. You get one shout out. Uh, you get when you have a membership, you get one special message per month that allows you to have. Yeah. Arena mode. Oh, the cars like the like the Rocket League type of mode. Plays giving out presents, and he's using the emotes now. What is this? This is madness, I say. But it was very nice that he he did membership gifting. Hmm. Bum, 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 bum. The breaking, though. Yeah, the broken token. See, that's what I don't get. Is like you're literally paying money for this battle pass, and the tokens don't work properly. Like, how? Membership gifting. Hmm. Oh, I accidentally closed the chat. My bad, guys. One, one sec there. Gotta, gotta open that back up. Bam. Now you guys will abuse the cool emotes, right? Now you're finally a member. Hardpoint. 
negative it was like a week of negative 40 man i was telling you it was freaking cold out it was really really cold like and that's celsius guys like it was it was really really i had to wear pants and like my warm jacket but like the craziest thing is again that's why we have chinooks because they come in with warm gusts of wind and they make it nice out uh, you know going from negative 40 to negative 8 that's what I'm saying, is like wearing shorts and like, you know, you could wear like shorts and a t-shirt. That's what kind of weather change it felt like was going to, to basically like summer. I felt like I was going to the beach <laughs> and how warm it was today versus the other days. Like right now, it's like negative one or two. And it's like, that is, that is nice. So I, I love that I, I live in a place where, like some people complain about the weather here, but I think it's just magical because it goes from like, super super lows to like really really high and it can change in a day you know you can go from like negative 20 to like 10 15 degrees it's insane and it's not like a global warming thing because it was like uh, leonardo dicaprio was filming the revenant here and he's like global warming guys i saw the weather change just like that and it's like no that's that's like a cool natural thing that like happens here and again in one place in dubai because they created a mountain it's, it's a very special natural phenomenon to this region. It's called a Chinook. You can look into it. It's, it's a really, really cool weather phenomenon. Yeah. So it's, it's kind of, it's really cool. Because you never know what kind of weather you're going to get here. It's crazy. We get all the seasons and everything like that. How did that guy not notice me? He literally like looked around the corner and whatever. Hmm. Damn it. <sighs> I'm hit. I that. Oh yeah, Thomas, you were having issues doing the membership thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see that now. You, you were having problems signing up for a membership. I don't know if anyone else gifts a set of five memberships. I will also gift a set of five memberships. Uh, yeah. We'll do a, you know, we'll do a thing like that. You've finally been chosen. I'm glad you've been chosen. It's a warm feeling when you get chosen, you know what I mean? By that special someone, aka Filet chose you. But yeah, I'm also trying to come up with like some kind of behind the scenes content for you guys that are members as well for Christmas, but it's sort of hard when it's so cool and there's like nothing to do, if that makes sense. Very, very hard to do. Oh. A gas man. How the hell did that guy kill me too? Get out of here. Hmm. He's from Burger Town. It's kind of weird that there isn't a map with Burger Town in this game, right? There's usually like a tradition thing they do in this game is to have like a multiplayer map featuring a Burger Town. They gave us none of that. It's a shame. Did I watch any Christmas movies today? No, 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 no. I, did, I didn't have any time for that. It was, it was a very busy day of doing stuff. Negative 8, that's still cold? No, I'm afraid not, my friend. It was, it was very, very nice. You hate the Terak maps? Yeah, I'm not a fan of it either. It's good for uh, distance kills, though. It's better than uh, the border crossing by, by a mile. But yeah, it was, uh, yeah, negative eight was, it was a lovely warm day today. It's all what you're used to, if that makes sense. Like, you get used to really, really warm weather, and then when the cold happens, you're like, oh. But then you get used to, like, really, really cold weather, and then, like, slightly less cold weather is, like, warm weather. It's all, uh, relevant to, again, temperatures, right? And being climatized. Ah, damn it, there's two of them? Hmm. Damn it. 
Elden Ring solo? I mean, I basically beat Elden Ring solo. You forgot you had two times XP on. Filet, what a waste. <laughs> I have all the classic maps on Warzone, right? That's because they're going to carve them out and give them to you, like, over time is basically what they're doing. It makes sense. Why, why give you all the toys and the cool maps right away, right? When they could piecemeal them to you. Or piecemeal them to you. Oh, jeez. I just Far Cried his ass. It just like it almost always think it makes me think of Far Cry when I'm like swimming in the water in this game. It's like some kind of weird water predator with a gun. You know what I mean? Not like the new Far Cries, but like the old, old Far Cries. That's what I always think of. God damn it. That was a waste of that kill streak, actually. Get ready. Bring the UAV online. Hostile UAV in the area. Oh, that's a teammate. Target area updated. Move to the hard point. Damn it. Have I done Adam Grab? We we tried to do the raid. It's a blue loading circle. That's really weird for you, Thomas. Maybe you just gotta like let it load for a while and then eventually it goes through. It's like um uh, what was it? When you when you buy something on like the 360 marketplace and you gotta like let it work itself out for a while. It could be like that. I don't know. It's weird that you have those problems. So I, I don't know why. We, we've tried to troubleshoot it too, which has been funny. Ah, but hey, you finally get to try it out. Oh, damn it. Was that the SAB? Freaking gun, man. It's gonna be like talking COD 4, and I'm always like, that damn M16. It's gonna be like the damn SAB for this game. Ten years from now, I'm gonna be playing about that gun. He's gone. What? How the hell did that guy kill me with that thing? This is ridiculous. It's unjust. Hmm. Did that guy drop shot it for no reason? It's stuffed, yo. Stuff for Christmas. Oh my god. There was a sale? You had a just for you sale? I've never had a just for you sale. Negative nine here. I saw somebody biking in negative 40. I couldn't believe it. You know, people are always like, oh, you're crazy for wearing shorts in the winter and stuff like that. This dude freaking cycling in negative 40. I was like bundled up after the gym wearing like jeans and my like super warm whatever jacket, like my super toboggan jacket. And this guy is just, he's just holding up all the traffic, cycling in negative four. In like a, not even like a winter outfit, it was like a light cycling outfit. I was like, dude, that's just, that's just dumb. You know what I mean? Like, you know, that was, that was just crazy. Like, I've done some crazy in weird weather kind of things, but like, cycling. I was like, people in their cars, they're just trying to like get home and everything like that, and you're, you're cycling down the middle of the road. Because here you're allowed to drive your, your bike. When you're, when you're on a bike, you're considered a vehicle, legally here. So other cars have to like treat you like an actual vehicle, even if you're going like way under the speed limit. And it's just like this dude, and it's like slippery out and stuff, and he's, he's cycling on his bike in negative 40. Couldn't fucking believe it. I was mind blown. And keep in mind, again, I wear shorts like almost all year through. Cycling. Why? Why was he cycling? Was he like for exercise? Was he cycling home? It's not like it was warm out and it started snowing and he had to deal with it. He literally chose, he got up that day and he's like, I'm cycling in this weather to go somewhere. Down like a regular, you know, it's not like he was in like a bike lane or anything. It's just a regular road, just this dude just cycling along. Throwing his hands up into the air that's cold and just like, why, why? It was windy too, it was bitter cold, absolutely bitter cold. 
and he's, he's just cycling away. What a dude. I'd say he'd have a lot of balls on him, but they were probably frozen and frostbitten. I was just like, I can't even, man. I, I can't even. Like, is he training for the Olympics? I guess if you can bike in that condition, you can bike in any condition, but still. Mind work. You wear thermals and bike? I don't know, man. He was wearing one of those tight bike suits, like, you know, the really, really tight kind of stuff. It didn't look like there was a lot of layering there going on. I don't know if we have it just for you on my end in Canada. I don't know, but, yeah. Cycling keeps... He wasn't moving very fast, guys. And I don't know if you've been in negative 40, but negative 40 is, like, a little beyond the I'm running around and keeping warm kind of weather, to be honest. Anyways, uh, be sure to like the stream. Subscribing's great, donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member, like Filet did. And he also, there's channel member gifting. Like I said, someone else does five channel memberships. I'll do five channel memberships. And then we can have more people as members and maybe work toward unlocking a new emote. What? There's also the Patreon option, buying this game, any game on the Xbox Store. The affiliate link in the video description is the way to go. And there's the Amazon affiliate link too. Haha. Uh -huh. I don't know, man. It's just, like, again, like, I don't know if you guys have even experienced negative 40, but it's like, it is unreal. Like, you know how you see when it's really hot out and there's like, on the metal, you see like heat waves? You see like cold waves on stuff. You see waves of cold. It's, uh... It's it's really freaking ridiculous. This guy is just cycling away. What a guy. Oh, uh, we were supposed to go to the store and take a look at stuff. Let's just see what map we get. Okay, that one's fine. Again, the Dune Stalker pack. Very, very good value. Merry Mayhem? Hmm. Claws. Ooh, free holiday packs. What did I get? What do we got? Oh, holiday tracks, okay. What about this one? Oh, a cheer wick, that's awesome. I actually love that. That's that's great. He was training for the bell end of I don't know man, but he was he was doing it. How do you use the emotes? You gotta use the weird smiley thing, it'll give you all these emotes. <laughs> now you're not biking, you'd walk. <laughs> Freaking hell, man. Mm. Yeah. Anyways, let's keep rolling. Domination. Glad you have it because it's too cold. It is, it is really, really cold. But like I said, it doesn't get here, you know, that cold all the time here. But I don't know, it's, it's just the weather. People really let things like the weather bother them a lot. Sometimes you just gotta go with the flow of things. Because it's not like you can control the weathering at all. Ow. These guys all got riot shields. Uh, Infinity Ward, please nerf them. Please. Nerfing them doesn't make them include making them hit you less. It's, it's just, or, you know, they need to hit you more to kill you. That's not nerfing them at all. Please make Modern Warfare 2 2 great again and get rid of, I don't know, something on the riot shields. Make you walk slower with them, make them so you can shoot them more easily while they're using them. Something. Throw me a bone. 20 on levels and you finish your battle. Nice. You're well on your way. Right, I just, I couldn't believe it. Seeing that guy just cycling along. Same with, like, again, I, I told the story of that. Somebody, like, snow blowed my car and I was just like. What is what is Canadian right here? I always used to love uh, at the old person, not the old person, the old folks, you know, uh, that house or whatever. I would, uh, you know, the community. Like there'd be a few dudes, and we would all like go out. And we'd all like shovel the whole like driveway and or not the driveway, but like the street area. It, there's nothing like a Canadian winter where you're you know working with your fellow 
dudes of the street to do all the shoveling. I always thought that was fun. Yeah. Good. I've, I've never had my car snow blowed before, and I thought that was just funny. Literally, like, couldn't stop laughing to like thank. I basically I thanked the guy, and I just was laughing the whole time. I was like, what a what a weird situation this is. It was very nice of him. It was very, very nice. <laughs> this is a snowblower. It was really effective. It got all the snow right off my, uh, right off my car. Ah, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Yeah. Come on, team. We need the B. I don't want to get absolutely blown away here. We have a, you know, it's a decently close score. Fire. You know, actually, kind of this map, so-so, not mind blowing, but so-so map. I, I don't mind this one. Kind of a different level design. Maybe you can stand on the B and help me. No, oh, never mind. He's dead. <sighs> I really get to play every so often, that's rough. Hello there. You don't think riot shields are that good? Dude, if riot shields weren't that good, you wouldn't see like 25 to 50% of the population wearing riot shields. Don't even give me that crap. You let me see asses I've seen running around with a riot shield on their back and a knife in their hands? Don't even give me that. It's like as bad as when the, the model 1886s were around in Modern Warfare 2, the original. It's, it's more rampant than uh, than quick scoping was back in the day, as the riot shield usage is. Yeah, you, you would not see that many people with riot shields if it wasn't ridiculously overpowered. Absolutely fucking ridiculous, the riot shields in this game. And I stand by that, because I've played however many goddamn days of this game. I, I know what's up. You get so much more of the membership. Have you used all the emotes yet? A lot of people love the emotes. How many people do Modern Warfare 2009? I don't, probably not too many. Hello there, welcome. Yeah, probably not too many. There's not that many dumb customers out there. I think most people kind of know what they get. Heck no. Now, remember that one stream we did, and there was like an entire other team that had like coordinate, color coordinated riot shields, and every single person was using one? <sighs> that was bad. I did not like that. Okay, I think A and B are the good ones to take, right? Because then you get the high ground building here to protect. Or protect. And we lost the beat. Damn it. Must be easily pleased. Okay, so I got a crosswalk wearing suited red high heeled hooker boots. Must have been Bedro. The question was was he rocking the high heeled hooker boots? That's what I want to know. I can't believe wine this is almost over. It's gonna be hard going back to regular hard liquor. But, you know, I did buy the, uh, the new bottle of crack, and like I said today, so that I'm ready. Oh, and I did, I saw the Kevin at the, uh, the liquor store there, too. He's like, it's mayhem, and I was like, it looks like mayhem. Yeah, he was, he was helping someone pick out wines, which I thought was kind of funny. Hmm. Val pass progression? It feels faster, but I feel like I'm also playing more of this. Can you do spec ops by yourself? Uh, I think you can, but I, I don't know if I'd advise it. I think you can. I don't know. 
I gotta uninstall the the, the co-op stuff again. Save that six gigs, you know. Should we go for B? Oh, what the hell? How did I even see me around there? I'm gonna miss the 12 days of wine miss. <sighs> it was a fun time, but uh, you know, the, the last bottle is tonight. Wine miss has ended. Yeah. I actually saw a lady picking up the, uh, the 12 days of wine miss package tonight. I was debating on getting another one, but I was like, eh, I don't know. It's like, do I need that again? Can I save it for next year? Maybe it'll be a new version next year. Ah. I don't think it sold that well, but I also think it was a little overpriced too. too. That was a big issue. Because it was 100 bucks, and now it's on sale for 70 Which is a great deal, you know, for 70 bucks. Oh, def. But for 100 bucks, it was kind of like, uh, but it was more like the novelty of doing it for me was the big thing. It was something to drink and have fun with during streams, right? Yeah. That was the big thing. Because that's what we do here. We have so much fun. Cheerful, happy days all around. Haha. -ha. The enemy controls two objectives. Get after him. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> Enemy UAV active. Like I was just hiding in the truck, that's fine. You don't see that too often. Except when you're fighting a team of riot shippers. And they all hide in the truck. Which was hilarious. No, oh, we didn't get the B. Look, it's like 99%. Our teammate, our teammate got it. Okay, good. Because I was like, wow. Well, I can't believe that didn't give it to us. And we still lost. I blame my team. They sucked. Happy Christmas. With the Santa hat. I tip my Santa hat to thee. Ooh, smoked him. It's still negative, man, that sucks. Hmm. More battle pass tokens that are glitched and won't show. Do I agree with the best Christmas movie results? Um, the best Christmas movie is uh, Christmas Vacation. It's the quintessential holiday family film. You know, it shows the history of like, you know, what I, of of like Christmas in regards to like you know generations of family, the father, the trying. It, it's just it's a perfect Christmas film. It, it's Christmas Vacation. So I guess no, I don't agree with the the poll results, but uh, yeah, that one is is pretty perfect. That one, or it's a Wonderful Life, but it's a Wonderful Life is like a different kind of film too on its own. But Christmas Vacation is the quintessential Christmas film. Yeah, like I stand by that. All right, do we got any more wine to pour? We do. We got a little bit of wine left. Nice. I actually thought it was funny. I was talking to my, my grandmother today, because, you know, I went and visited, like I said. And she's like, she wants something about uh, sclerosis or whatever. More like, Apparently these doctors are shocked that younger people are having, you know, liver problems and stuff. And I'm like, it's probably because of those years of COVID where they had nothing to do but sit there and drink all the time. And that's probably why. She's like really worried about drinking too much. And she's like, you know, no more. Only four bot. What was it? Only four drinks of alcohol a night or a day, and I was like, 
I think I'd need to increase my alcohol intake a lot to achieve that level of drinking. <laughs> kind of having a laugh over that one. Yeah. Always worried about my health. It's, it's kind of funny. Yeah, I also get that from uh, my mother as well. It's always like, oh, I'll drink it too much. I'm like, you tell me stories about back in the day that you could buy like three dollar beers you could have like a she, she's you know her and the old man always tell me about like you could buy like a plate because they didn't even have limits you could buy like a plate of like beers and it'd be like two three four dollars a beer you know and he, well i think it was like two buck beers or something they said and you could have a whole freaking tray of them and they just would you know get wasted all the time and i'm like you know and, and me having a drink occasionally that's when i live around like okay yeah, it's hilarious. They, they, they tell stories of like dollar shots, and you would have like a whole freaking platter of dollar shots. And it's like, yeah, but he heaven forbid I have wine or you know a little shot a night or something. Ugh, ridiculous. Hello there. Hey, I actually really like this map. You know, like this one. Huh. I, I just I kind of find it neat because it's like a different like design for a level. If that makes sense. Suck on this, cabron. A hit marker, but not a kill. That sucks. Ah, oh, crap. Shouldn't have reloaded, should have waited. Run, kill, let the whole thing. Hmm. Nice. Yeah, it's gonna clutch it, guys. Look at him. Three six one eight eight six eight. He's not the first to hatch, nor the last, but he's got a big number going on. Oh, he clutched it. He, he did it. Yeah, you, you missed out there, Bateman. Uh, Filet pitched in and grabbed channel memberships for people. He was like Santa. He was like Santa. Oh, come on. Like that guy knew I was gonna be there. What is this? The Liver King? Well, that's really on top of it. Oh, he got lucky. Okay. Have a good one there, Flamed. Yeah, I like this level too. I think it's pretty cool. And a Merry Christmas, Santa Hat. Taran Dad Zap Up? That's a weird name. Thanks for that. I'm trying to think if there's anything more festive to showcase and whatnot. <sighs> yeah, we'll, we'll see if I'm feeling up to getting that Minecraft Christmas video edited tonight. I don't know. We'll see how I'm feeling. Reloading. How late I want to stay I up. I do want to watch my Frosty Returns movie, though. Or I think it's The Legend of Frosty the Snowman is called. I think that's what it's called. I was getting revived and they killed him? That sucks. He's online. Oh, Dylan's online. Him and his pals, they all went to, to Ranchman's the other night. I was like, oh, Would have been cool to get invited. It's like a club. It's like a... We have Western clubs here. That's all the clubs are, like, Westerns, you know? Because of the culture or whatever. So, like, country music type stuff. And I was like, that would have been fun to go. I never get invited anymore to the parties because, you know, they're all, they're all coupled. They're, they're kind of all of them are married, actually. So I get left out of things now. It's sad, but it's part of life. Prisma, rescue. Let's go. What the hell is that guy doing? He's like jumping on the pop machines. It's weird. The F1 cars? The F1s have kill cams? You, you can die from, like, the F1 car going by? Is that what you're saying? Oh, that's weird. You know what's not weird, guys? Liking the stream! What? Subscribing's great, donation's cool. 
Consider becoming a channel member. It's a dollar to join from the weird money thing below the chat. If you're thinking of channel member gifting, if somebody gives five more channel memberships, I'll give five channel memberships. And that means ten people can have channel memberships. There's also the Patreon option if you prefer that. Buying this game, any game on the Xbox, there will be affiliate link in the video description. Thanks to the Microsoft Store, I mean, probably buying it digitally anyways. There's also the Amazon affiliate link. If you're buying anything on the Amazon Store. Amazon. Hmm. Oh look, Flay joined back. Did all your double XP disappear? You bought Lion Head Rabbit Presidents this year and partner wrapped them for her? What? What what are you, what are you saying, Thomas? I don't, I don't understand what that even means. Hmm. I know, like the stream, what a crazy concept. What a feeling. Ah. Hmm. Oh, Mercado Los Alamos. I'm just glad we haven't had that, that terrible freaking lake. Uh, you know the map I'm talking about? The border crossing one? Yeah, I'm just glad that hasn't popped up. Hate that level. Hate it, hate it, hate it. Bum, bum, bum. Mercato Los Alamos. Hmm. Uh, let's do this team. It's a bunny with the mane of a lion? The rabbits? Domination. I don't even know what you guys are talking about. Anyways, We're let's go. Bravo. I'm so confused. Ow, ow, ow. Damn it. The rabbits. Oh, the, the rabbits from, like, uh, the Ubisoft rabbits? You know, I've mentioned that before, that I think if Ubisoft would have pushed for the rabbits to be in, like, a movie, I think they would have taken the place of the minions, because the minions are basically just rabbits, but they're yellow. Seriously, they're, like, the exact same. They do the same stupid stuff, they have the same kind of, like, love of weird random-ass costumes. They're, they're basically just minions, but, like, you know, they came out before the minions. I feel like Ubisoft actually really missed out on the potential of, like, Malcolm X for, like, millions of dollars. We're taking Alpha. We're taking Alpha. Objective Alpha secure. Enemy securing Bravo. What? This is mad. A rabbit? It's a lion head rabbit? I don't know about the rabbit. It's like, is it like a statue? I'm, I'm really not sure what you're talking about. Halo? Yeah, Halo's pretty cool. Bunny technicians to fix the, the, the cables. Bunny Park? Oh, Bunny Park was enjoyable. It's a bunny with the mane of a lion. Okay. Can someone send like a photo of what this looks like so I get an idea what the hell you guys are talking about? A bunny with a lion. Weird. Yeah, I think all the bunnies died though, because that bunny plank. I mean, I choose to believe that the bunnies hopped off into a better place, but pretty sure the bunnies all got uh, planked out, sadly. It happens. Hmm. Well, that was convenient. Oh, there's another person. Damn it, the freaking pistols, man, are so powerful in this. Ridiculous. It's a breed of a pet rabbit. So this is an actual rabbit you buy that has like a mane? Is is that what you're talking about? I really really don't understand this. Secure Bravo. 
that's a, what is that gun? That is incredibly loud. You, you guys hear that gun there? What is that? I don't remember a gun being that loud in this. But that was really, really loud. Gotta be some kind of LMG or something like that. What a feeling. Securing objective Bravo. Securing Alpha. Oh, that's a teammate. Alpha secure. Hmm. Secure Bravo. <laughs> Got him. That was not a drop shot. I was just crowd or lying down, anyways. Yeah. <laughs> Your pet rabbit. So you, it's a breed of bunny. Oh, okay. What, what does it look like? Is it just like a, a large bunny with like a mane or something? Because I'm on the Instagram. And I check out the guinea pigs. They usually include rabbits in that. So I see some pretty crazy bunnies doing dopey bunny things, which is kind of cute, but yeah. I don't, I don't know if I've heard of that one, but I gotta say those bunnies have insane vertical. Like, they can really jump. I think it would also surprise people that guinea pigs can actually jump pretty pretty high. They can jump over like staircases, because they live in like a cool, damp, kind of like rocky climate, naturally. But yeah, some of the guinea pigs, they can go, whew. Insane vertical for their size, essentially. But yeah, those bunnies, I've seen some like, nuts jumps. Nuts jumps. You're not having fun anymore? I've, I've been having a blast with this game. Yeah, Mario Warfare 2 too, I've, I've been thoroughly enjoying this one since launch. That was weird. She was like right beside me and didn't even notice me. Odd. I do need new levels though. I'm I'm desperate for some new maps in this game. I'm still having fun with it, but I, I am desperate for new maps. Objective Bravo is compromised. Take it back. Enemy UAV active. Also UAV in the air. Taking Alpha. Throwing grenade. Throwing. I'm loading. Damn it, man. Chivalry 2, Witcher 3, fun games. A bunny with a mane. Well, don't take your word for it. it sounds a bit peculiar, but, you know, it's, it's, it's cool. Yeah, I, I get it, it's neat. How did that person come from? They're just chilling, looking the other way. Yeah, okay. Well, we got a lead here. We're up by like 40 points, so hopefully that holds. Well, we'll take A. A. Outer Worlds? What do you mean about the Outer Worlds? I got a video review of the Outer Worlds. What, what more do you want? Are you like a stream of the Outer Worlds DLC? It's it's been on my mind, but you know it, it comes when it comes, right? In my mind, I really want to do a Godfather livestream. <laughs> I had uh, 
a, a lot of fun playing that for a video. Like a lot of fun. I was I actually forgot how good that game was. But we've never tried a 360 stream. It would actually be very interesting. I want to become the Don of New York, guys. It's been long enough. The Sky Captain deserves to become the Don of New York, and only through grinding will that be achieved. At least that's what they say. We're losing Alpha. Securing Charlie. We got this. We've lost Alpha. We lost Alpha by the gods. We control Charlie. Yeah, we got. I think we'll win this match. We're up by a lot. We're losing Bravo. Enemy UAV action. Damn it. He's rocking the Lockman 5, guys. Not to be confused with the MP5, which is iconic. Can't believe they got rid of the MP5 game. That's mind blowing to me. This is such an iconic weapon with this. I haven't played it. Or yeah, you have, you have to play the, the Godfather on 360. It's, it's not backwards compatible. Otherwise, it would have had a Series X video for that one, like, years ago. Um. Yeah, no, it's that one's uh, not backwards compatible. Probably because of the licensing, I would imagine. You know, because you'd have to have the Paramount okay, you'd have to have whatever family owns, whatever part of that. And yeah, it was probably a licensing issue. Or it could have just been like, no, nah, it was probably licensing, because there's two Godfather games, none of them are backwards compatible. It was probably a licensing thing. Yeah, sadly. Great game, though. Absolutely great game. Yeah. Like I said, there's there's a lot of things I mention on the stream of things I want to do, and then sometimes it takes a long time for stuff to happen. Eventually I get around to things, but sometimes it takes a while. And I do need to go to the bathroom, so enjoy the alpaca. I'll be back in a sec. The alpaca give. That was such a good little thing with the alpacas and stuff. I love the alpaca photo this year. It turned out really good. I haven't had time because I've been dealing with so much other stuff, but I gotta look if there's other alpaca photos I wanna buy. Probably not even up still. Uh, I'll go take a look, but uh, yeah, it's on the list. Oh, I got sent a picture of the. Uh, Oh, Filet sent me a dog drinking Pepsi. That's great. And then Zarcaster. Oh, that's what that bunny looks like? The little bunny with the mane? That's adorable. That's really adorable. I find bunnies really dopey. 
it's not a bad thing, but I, I find bunnies really, really dopey. I like the guinea pigs because, <laughs> you know, but like, yeah, I, I do find bunnies just hilariously dopey. <laughs> like flopping about doing bunny things. Very, very funny. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. Okay, let's do this. I love this map, so I'm very happy that we got it. Yeah, so if we... I'm, I'm still hoping I get invited to a media days to do a hotel video, or not a hotel, a spa video. If it does, we'll bring out, like, the sexiest spa video thing I've ever done. It'll be mind-blowing. Fingers crossed. I mean, we might get, like, you know, canceled out because we do gaming, but it, it would be fun to do. Anyway, so if you don't get the context of that, basically when we are streaming the beta, I was looking at the spa, and we were talking about doing a spa thing, and it was a big thing. And I reached out to one of the companies that does media stuff, and I'm like, signed up for if they do a media day, I might get invited, so we'll do a video if that's the case. It was basically because the spa looks so enticing in this game. If anything, I should buy myself a spa package or something. I deserve it, what can I say? Work hard. But it would be cool to do a media day there. Because then we can make a fun video, which would be entertaining, you know. Yeah, that would be the thing. Oh, Merry Christmas, Noctis. Merry Christmas. You got a crit controller for Christmas? That's cool, man. The lead controller? That's nice. Hope you enjoy that. Hmm. But yeah, I, I love this level. Favorite map in the game. A little disappointed though, I am out of wine. <sighs> On your six. Don't be confused by the innocent face so that they can bite you. That's funny. <laughs> Just imagining a, a dopey little bunny biting you. That, that's so funny. Guinea pigs bite too. You know, the, uh, what is it? It's different breeds of guinea pigs. There's like, I think it's the, the Abbeys, the Obsidians. Those ones are called the, the sassy guinea pigs because they're the more aggressive breed of them. <laughs> it's just like, there's something so funny about this tiny little ball of fur. Because, you know, guinea pigs are like kind of like, think a small cat or dog. That's basically what a guinea pig is. And it's just like, yeah, the, the obsidians are the, uh, the abbeys. They're, they're, they're the sassy guinea pigs. They're the, they're the ones that are like kind of asses a little bit. But it's just really funny because they'll give you like the attitude look too. And it's like, why does this little creature have so much attitude? You know, guinea pigs are pretty bold because, you know, we're these huge towering monsters that give them free food and, you know, take care of them. And yet they're still not afraid to, like, bite you or give you sass. But if they do like you, you know, the guinea pigs will, like, you know, they love pets and stuff. They're, they're pretty nice. You know, like, we pet them and be really nice to give you some little, like, love licks and stuff and, you know, all, all that. They're very, very calm, nice creatures, for the most part. Could be after some sassy, so. What is Cognac? What, 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 what's, what's Cognac? What are, you, what are you talking about? Yeah. Just imagining these bunnies biting you. <laughs> Dissatisfied with the carrots. <sighs> Hippity hoppity hoppity a bite. Okay, let's go. Man, I can't believe the year is almost over. I really thought I would get more done this year. Not on the YouTube, but like, well, actually, I did expect a little bit more subs, but, you know, no game releases. Just like personally, I thought I would get more done. It's always next year. Always next year. And the year after that. So I've got a long life to live, I think. Unless I die tragically. Personnel at 
and hopefully we can get one of those in memoriam black and white video things of me being like doing all these dumb things during streams that would be entertaining. Alcohol? Cognac? Alcohol? I'm not familiar with that. I don't know what you're talking about. The only thing I know that people are talking about is when they get that euphoria of when they like the stream. What? What a concept. Subscribing's great. The nation's cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Yeah, like Filet did. There's also channel member gifting. And like I said, if somebody gives five channel memberships, I'll gift five channel memberships. And we'll get ever closer to unlocking a new emote called a channel member subscribe-a-thon. There's also the Patreon option, buying this game, any game on the Xbox Store, the affiliate link in the video description. There's also the Amazon affiliate link. Yeah, those options. Woo! Crazy, right? Damn it. Cognac. I feel like that's not it. I feel like it's similar to an alcohol that I'm thinking of, but I feel like it's not quite it. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why does it look white out here? Oh, it's the smoke. I was like, what the hell? Why is this so glowing? I was like, it's weird, right? Hard point points where you can. Enemy personnel at the hard point. Taking fire. Ow. Yeah, I feel like this map doesn't come up enough. It's great. Great, great level. That was lucky. But I will take it and hide in this pot. That was close. I think he missed. Down by a lot. Like a lot, a lot. When our whole team's on this, and we still can't hold it down. Hmm. Is that guy doing like 360? A little weird. A little weird. I'm so close to a chopper gunner again. It's gonna be like the fourth time I'm close to a chopper gunner and get shot, isn't it? I don't really see anybody coming though. Chopper gunner! Did I get the. the. no, I didn't get the freaking. Gunship. Uh, well, this is the worst map to get this on, anyways, but uh, you know, we'll fun with it. What? That guy's like right where that explosive is. Yeah, they're all inside there, so that kind of sucks. I feel like the rocket should like open the door, you know what I mean? And there goes the chopper gunner. Well, that was worth it. It was like two seconds. It was like a premature helicopter uh, loss. That's that's for sure. Yeah. I don't even know why they killed the helicopter. I got like two kills off of them. It's a huge waste. Like, what is, what's even the point of jumping in the helicopter at that point? I died. Cognac? 
I don't know what you're talking about, man, for the alcohol. Sorry. No, no idea there. I might, if I was, like, at a bottle or something, but, yeah, I don't, I don't quite know what the trick you're talking about is. Sorry. Well, I went positive, so I can't really complain. Filet had it rough there. Hmm. Another battle pass token that doesn't show up. I wonder how close I'd actually be to finishing. Hmm. It's a very, very good question. Very good question indeed. Have a good one there, Thomas. Hope your Christmas is good. Hmm. Prisna rescue. What do we got for map? Oh, the border crossing of hell. Let's do it. Ooh, looks like Filet's almost got a, a skip for him. He's at 98. Yeah, because I did like, what, four levels and then the skip? I, I don't know. It might be worth restarting the game at some point and seeing if I got enough... Battle pass tokens to finish it off. Ooh, Filet's leaving. You can't handle the uh, the border crossing. Throwing your body on the point didn't work. Man, we were down so many points. That wasn't even worth it. You only got a suicide for the position when you know our team's got a chance of getting it done. Santa's in the border crossing of hell. Yeah, I don't like this level. What the, the blub blub sound? You heard that? Weird. It's very, very weird. Hmm. Alright, we're gonna die alive, but let's get it done. What's your buck? Love how all these guys have like ridiculous number chains behind their name and I just like don't have anything. That was a good grenade kill. Is he letting that one guy kill everyone? Ugh. Damn, that sucks to suck. Sock Whisper is reviving me? Thanks, bro. I'm in your debt. Switching legs. That guy saving me could have just won us this game. Thanks. I'll get you fixed up. On your fix. Nice. I'll probably only get 50 points for that. Hmm. It's a weird kill cam. Oh, there we go. Whoa, what a lucky shot. Who will take it? Who is not rescue? I hope this time next year we've got like a fun Activision Xbox like tie-in with like COD doing some sort of Christmas thing. They probably can't because they're marketing right. That'd be cool. Prisna, rescue. You guys not gonna go kill those guys that I've all highlighted for you in that middle area? Okay. Well, I'll take the 100 points. Why not? What? No, I wanted the shotgun. You are all that's left. What? Ah, oh, I thought I could escape. Yeah, the bloop bloop. 
Bloop, bloop. I really don't get where that sound comes from or why that sound plays. Nice. Look at me, just holding it together from the squad. The hero they needed. On this U.S. border crossing. Oh, that was close. One more step, I would have died. Out of ammo! One guy left. Go finish him off. There we go. Good win, guys. Good win. But the bloop bloop, what does it mean? What does it do? That's the guy that revived me earlier, allowing us to win that first round. That crucial first round. I've got more kills than my entire team put together. I'm kind of carrying. Just putting that out there. Kind of carrying. It's gonna be nice to have the Santa hat off so it won't obscure my vision. <laughs> Ah, oh, that was a perfect Semtex. I gotta give it to him. Absolutely perfect. Am I gonna get a revive? Considering I'm literally carrying the team. Maybe not. I would rather get sniped and save me. Okay. Ah, oh, man, if those guys just would have saved my life, we would have had this. We would have had it. Go team, go! Covering you. What? Somehow failed to climb, should I go for the kills? So close on that guy. So, so close. The round is lost. Focus on the next one. Damn, my team's... I approve the Activision acquisition. I'm very much looking forward to it, yes. Why wouldn't I be? It's gonna be great. I mean, I'm not a regulator, and I get to choose, but it's gonna be awesome. I'm with you. Really? Man, that's a good triple kill. Damn it. Our whole team's falling apart. Now, what a grenade literally screwed us. Falling apart, we're losing now. We can only carry so hard, you know. And then we lose. Sucks to suck. Hopefully, we can get it this time. One grenade is all it takes. Seriously, it was a triple kill. Basically, crippled our squad. That's what the stupid car is in this.
Ugh. SAB, man. Oh, that's the SBR. My bad. Same thing. cheating because he was looking through walls there <laughs> this map sucks in general i hate this level we only play it when we're playing uh this game mode otherwise we skip this map entirely i think it's absolute hot trash absolute hot trash Whoa, did he just 360 after that kill? What skill, yo? What skill? What's your block? Grenade out! Stun grenade out! That was a good grenade kill. Oh, come on, that guy should have died from those freaking hurricane shots. Get out of here. The RPK, that should take longer to spin up, too. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, museum is, is gone, gone. I, I think they couldn't work out the licensing on that one, sadly. Sounds like it's gone, gone. Who knows? marker but no kill so did he kill me with his gun or shooting the car with his gun kind of confused by that what's up Just answering the call the camera on the helmet oh i find it kind of like nauseating a little bit <sighs> well, that sucks i did my best See this guy can get the cap on this uh, prisoner here. Turn the tide. Oh! Did he get the extraction? He actually got that. Wow! Clutch extraction. Against all odds. <laughs> like that, that body came back up. That's funny. Body literally like ooh, back from the grave. But yeah, I hate this map so so much. Enemy left. Moving in. Hey, there we go, we got it. Now we can get off this level. Right on. Good work. Job team. Hmm. Oof. Yeah, hey, good KD ratio, nice. It was good, good. I do wonder if we'll get enough battle pass tokens tonight to actually finish it. Cause we got seven left, and I think I have three or four sitting there, but I have to restart the game for them to pop up. What time is it? It's in the morning.
Hmm. Ah, let's see what map we get. Merry Christmas indeed. Ow. Ooh, far, Farm 18? I haven't had this map actually for a while. That's weird. Very, very weird. Anyways, you know it's not weird? Liking the stream? What a concept. Subscribing's great, donations, cool. Consider becoming a channel member, cool perks, cool mode. It's a dollar to join from the weird money thing below the chat. There's also channel member gifting. Again, if someone gifts five channel memberships, I'll gift five channel memberships. Crazy. There's also the Patreon option. Buying this game, any game on the Xbox Store. The affiliate link in the video description. As it takes the Microsoft Store, I get a percentage. There's also the Discord option for stream alerts. And people chat on there. There's also the Amazon affiliate link. Oh, hello there, Kirkland. Thanks for approving the deal. That's funny. Just go to the title screen? Oh, okay. Hmm. Didn't know that. Did not know that. Let's go, team. We're going to the farm to farm some kills. There's too many bodies, weird people with knives, crazy stuff going on. Might as well get some of the last points on this one. How did that guy not die? Am I expecting any presents? I mean, I'll probably get one too. I would High on life? I, I did a couple reviews on High on life. I've, I've definitely covered that one, yeah. Shot in the back, that sucks. Locating the next hard point, get ready. Enemies inside the perimeter. Guess I'll hold the next hard point. Hard line online. Hostile UIV in the area. I'm behind this door. Usually they run in here all crazy on gun, you know, guns, uh, running gun and loaded and all that. Don't open the door like that, dude. Let them open the door the other way. Why are we smoking this building? expecting it to. Let's think about Rambo. What? Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll see what I get. You know, it's just any gifts are nice gifts when you get older. It's, it's a little different, I think, when you, when you get old. Yeah. 
I was kind of hoping for socks, but I've been told they couldn't find the socks I was wanting, so. No socks. I'll have to try and find myself some this year. They're, it's a rarity the socks I buy. It's like some Nike socks, but they're kind of hard to get for some reason. In this city, I don't get it, but you know. Now she goes. Friendly cluster mine deployed. That one's all right. Enemy personnel at the hard point. That was close. <laughs> How many of them are there? The drill charges? Yeah, I have a hard time figuring out where those are. I covered Banner Lord 1. Um, not covering Banner Lord 2. They didn't send me a code for it, so. Too bad. Hmm. I think it's a different guy than the guy I started shooting at. Christmas, the Tease was the songs where it's at, man, or the very seductive uh, Last Christmas from uh, Carly Rae Jepsen. But yeah, wham! Last Christmas is the, uh, the OG. Wham! You know what I'm talking about? Wham! They all end. Enemy UAV active. They got an enemy UAV, which is not good for me. Yeah, not doing too bad on this life. Ah. Oh, hello there, Larry. Delivers me, I told you. Get out of the cutout. Merry Christmas, folks. Hello there. Welcome. Everybody's having a good time. I'm not that exciting of a thing to get under the tree. Ah. 
hell is this person here? There they are. I get him? I think I got him. Oh, now I'm dead. When he stretches out his voice. Ugh. What am I sipping on? I had the last drink of wine this, so that's gone now. So I have nothing else. I gotta finish setting up this PC for my sister, so I might grab some crackers and meat and cheese and have some of that afterwards as I finish off installing everything, but yeah, it's gonna be a long night, but I want to get it ready for her for tomorrow. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's about it. So I don't know if there's any eggnog left. We'll see what tomorrow's brings. I always enjoy Christmas, but it's gonna be a little, little splintered. It's not the, uh, the grandparents are a bit uh, splintered this year, so it'll be interesting to see what happens. PS5s on Amazon Canada? I heard there was some stores, GameStops, that had PS5s in the other day, but I don't know. The snipers? Very, very overpowered, I must say. Very, very overpowered. Good win, guys. I'd like to see that. Good win out there. Crackers, mean cheese is amazing. Yeah, it is. Like I said, I got the snowflake Ritz crackers, and I got the cheese slice things from Costco, and I've got like little cheese squares, and I got like these little meat pack things from Costco, and it's it's just really good. Yeah. So that'll be nice. I'll be sitting there installing all the drivers, and because basically I'm like making a cascading computer upgrade across the thing like I it took four hours or something to clone this really old hard drive to a of me drive so like my sister will have this you know my old PC to use for free or whatever you know so you can enjoy it she just has to buy windows and then the old man can have the the other PC that she used so he can have that one which is really old so I gotta take the hard drive I cloned out of there and put it back into the other one and then I gotta set up the new one with the driver so that it works properly. <sighs> I hope it'll be easy but in my mind it's gonna be a pain in the ass. Well we'll see what happens. What's the poison? It was the last drink of wine miss but it's it's gone now. It's gonna be happy she got a new PC? No, she's probably gonna be like, say some kind of sarcastic, sassy comment towards me, but whatever. It's not my gift anyways, I actually bought her a gift, but yeah, it's just, uh, just getting it ready for the PC. Yeah, so it's not a gift thing. It, I mean, it is, but it's not. SMG? <laughs> SMG user? Yeah, that's the way to go. And we get to play headquarters on the hotel! Yes! We got headquarters, or we got hotel like three times tonight. I feel so, so lucky that that has happened. It's the map that keeps on giving. Did you guys see there was a couple cool leaks today? The, uh, the Prey prototype from 1995 leaked. And the uh, Rayman 4 build leaked as well, I think yesterday or late last night. So, kind of a cool day from, you know, gaming history perspective, you know. PC coverage? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do some PC videos with the 4090. Uh, the, there's a League of Legends video plan. It's been filmed. I have to add audio commentary to it, though. So I gotta coordinate that with my sister if she actually plays that game. Because I thought it would be fun to tie League of Legends into the game, because, you know, they added that on Game Pass PC, so I, so I thought that might be a fun tie-in video. I have the 4090, and then I've got some other 4090 videos planned that I want to do, but I've just been uh, really busy on getting the PC set up, doing holiday stuff, working on all this stuff. It's been really, really busy, so... Yeah. The plan is to do some 
49 you can do this though, eventually. Do I find Christmas as exciting? Um, I, I think the, the magic isn't quite there, but I still really love the Christmas feel. I think I have more of a, I don't know how to describe it, more of a matured enjoyment view of Christmas now. You know, I, I like the feeling of it. You know, listening to the music, watching the movies, the, the festivities and the events, you know, interacting with the family, uh, finding presents, wrapping presents and stuff. I, I enjoy all that stuff. I am more interested in getting to the point where, like, you know, like I said, it'd be great to have a family and then be able to pass on my Christmas traditions would be really nice. And, um, it's a little sadder too, though, as obviously I've mentioned the grandparents are getting older, so they're not in the best of health, so we don't get to do the Christmassy stuff like we used to. And COVID also kind of ruined the traditional Christmas. And, yeah. So it's not quite what it was, but it's also like, you know, it's just something that evolves and changes as you get older. I still enjoy it, though. It's, it's more like the season of the year, the time of the year I quite enjoy. But it would be nice to get uh, eventually connected like a loved one and be able to enjoy that aspect of aging with Christmas, I think would be lovely. But, uh, yeah, hopefully for next year. We'll see. We will see. Hmm. But yeah, I, I still, in, in general, I enjoy the time of the year. Got those bumpin' Christmas tunes. And the Christmas alpaca photos are fun to do. I always enjoy that. Yeah. Good times. I'm kind of hoping I get the sneak in a watch of uh, Babylon tomorrow in a theater. It would be lovely. You have a good one there, Clay J. Merry Christmas indeed. Yeah. Active. Our counter UAV is active. Our UAV is orbiting. Aw, oh, freaking VTOL, man. Oh, that sucks. I like I wasn't on the UAV, damn it. You don't have anyone with you on Christmas? That's sad. I mean, I'll probably stream tomorrow again, so you can jump in if you need to get some people interaction, but, uh, yeah. That's, that's sad, but, uh, hopefully you can connect well enough over video stuff. What the hell is that? Where am I getting sh like, whatever. Oh, the headquarters isn't even offline yet? Come on, guys. There's like three dudes left. Oh my god. <sighs> we keep getting stomped on this map, which is sad because I like this level so much. Securing the enemy HQ. Stand by. Mm hmm. Sure, Larry. Sure, yeah. New HQ located. Move to the objective. Hmm. Friendly UAV online. It's always a funny time in the chat. Killed in the lobby there. Oh, they kind of ran right into my shots there, right on. I got knew exactly where I was. Enemy contact! Contact! Yeah, there is crossplay. It's all up to the battle, buddy. Can he get the job done? Yeah, I'm 
I'm also trying to reconnect with my NVIDIA contact, which has been a pain, but hopefully that happens this year. Play style from competitive to casual? Oh, the sexy 2023 calendar? I don't even, I've never done a calendar before. You're talking about a sexy Sky fans calendar? Anyways, it's been a while. Be sure to like the stream. Subscribing's great. Uh, donations, cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool emotes. It's a buck to join from the weird money thing below the chat. There's also channel member gifted. If you give five, or someone gives five channel memberships, I'll gift five channel memberships. Oh, ho, ho. Yo, yo, yo. Uh, alternatively, the Patreon option, buying this game, any game on the Xbox store, the affiliate link in the video description. It's also the Amazon affiliate link as well. With trophy system activated. Oh, come on, teammates. That's a setting you gotta talk with? That's an actual thing in this game? That's a weird one. Hmm. How does that guy go with the riot shield? There he is, throwing a knife at me. I hate those guys. Damn it, I was hoping that stun would help me go and get that kill, but I guess not. Hmm. Yeah, cool, it's just... I believe we lost the headquarters, guys. I thought we were better than this. Fucking SAP. Oh, yep. Ah, oh, that guy just me off. Oh, he's still got a slight lead. That looks like he came back a bit. How is that guy not dead? To do the hurricane plus the shotgun shot? Come on. Get out of here. I mean, with the skill base, it's probably just kind of getting to get regardless of settings. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, the Skyfans calendar. I don't know if you guys have unlocked that kind of treat. <laughs> hmm. No setting I might have to look into, though. It really can make a difference. So I'm definitely not playing this all esports like. Throwing knives, man, I hate riot shakers. SAB, insta kills. Literally takes no skill to use. Ah, throwing knife by the riot shielder again, of course. Am I going out for New Year's? No. Why would I go out for New Year's? Watch Tony Hawk? That is not my game. I think I do okay from a fun perspective. I, I don't think I've ever said in the Tony Hawk games that I'm proficient or grand at them, but that's, that's funny. Not your game. Huh. Trophy system deployed. Yeah, why, why, what would I have to do for New Year's? I'd probably just sit around and stream something. We're not all like Joel, where we got all these fancy party invites. Motor strike on the way! Changing mag! Damn it. 
Huh. But I am hoping we get some more Tony Hawk stuff when uh, Xbox picks up Enemy Activision area. Blizzard, though. That would be nice. Brand new Tony Hawk, or remakes of the 3 and 4 and stuff. Yeah, it might be something to look at, or just read a bit about there. Uh, Kirk, just to kind of take a look and see what those settings do. Because I still feel with the skill based matchmaking, you know, you know, it'll give you what you get, right? Fucking knifers. allow myself to have some of that fancy wine on New Year's, though. The shipwrecked bottle wine. Like, that guy was alive? I was like, why is my gun kind of, like, drying over there? And I was like, he looks dead. This is just the last stand. Apparently the remake sold very well when they were working on a sequel, when Activision needed to fold them in to work on, was it uh, Overwatch or something they got folded into? I think they got folded into Blizzard Vicarious, from what I recall. I think it was to work on Overwatch, or it was to work on Diablo, something like that. Which sucks, but you know, it goes how it goes, right? Hopefully that will happen less um, with Microsoft. Hopefully that happens less. Roomba? What's what's Roomba? Roomba? Are you talking about like the dancing fitness stuff? Rumba? What's it called? Zumba. Is it Zumba? 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 The dancing stuff? Yeah, Joel's got all the, the parties lined up, which is fun. But uh, yeah, no. I, I don't really have anything lined up. I'll just probably be streaming or something. Or finding something else to do. Maybe I'll have one of those introspective nights where I question what the hell I'm doing this last year. We'll see. Still two guys left. Stay frosty. Man. <sighs> Next objective located. Secure. Hmm. I do miss the uh, the rolling lobby days of uh, matchmaking. I also feel like matchmaking is faster. It was a very different map. Rebel Mitchell? I don't know. He doesn't live here. I could text him and see what he's up to, but I'm sure he's having some kind of fun party thing or something. Shipment playlist, and there's a bunch of options. Oh, interesting. Yeah, I'll, I'll read into it a little bit later on, see if I want to change things up or not. Yeah. Ugh, not a good match.
Another battle pass token. See, I'm kind of tempted if we go to the main menu, apparently, and I restart this, we see our battle pass tokens. People running around knifing? Yep. A vacuum murder game. I definitely have not played that. Is that the message of the day? Oh. Oh, no, I don't want to do the DMZ. No, 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 no. Oh, these menus are garbage. Oh, that does load up your battle pass tokens. Interesting. It's still up here. Three tokens left? Oh my god. Becky, would you look at these tokens? Merry Christmas indeed. Yes, quite so. Hmm. Yeah, but the riot shield knifing is getting annoying. It's been annoying since launch. Same with the SBR and the SPR. Or, it's, sorry, the SBR and the SBA, SAB. Those are annoying. Ah, freaking drives me nuts. But that's what you have to deal with when you're out here answering the call of duty. I don't know, will we get enough tokens tonight to get the rest of this? We're literally three away. So close, but then what will we do after we finish the battle pass? What will be the purpose of Call of Duty? Will it be for fun? Oh! <gasps> hmm. That's gonna be weird. Playing things for fun. Huh. Soups and subs tomorrow. Well, I hope you enjoy that, Larry. I hope you enjoy. Mercado Los Albus. Yeah. E O M M. It's like S B M M, but like slightly not as killing you. People kept using RPGs. It's not that bad. I hate the one where it's like it's the lock-on rocket, you know, where it kind of like shoots off into the air and comes down. That one drives me freaking bonkers. It's like a javelin, but like a new version of it. Yeah, there's a few things really annoying about this game. It it basically feels like the original Modern Warfare 2 with the silly kind of stuff, but just like 10 years later. So you just got violent, right? You mean you just like watched it or? <laughs> Let's go. Let's go, team. Double kill. We're losing Bravo. Enemy's taking Charlie. Ah, damn it. Take it back. To play as much as you can? I mean, if they were wanting me to play as much as they could, they would uh, expand the battle pass or something. I don't know. It really just won't be much to do once it's finished. It's kind of weird. I don't think I've ever like finished the battle pass this like early on, really. Except for maybe doing the streams of like Vanguard and that unlocking like the uh, battle pass stuff for uh, Cold War back in the day. That was a very far long shot, holy. Insta kill with those rifles. Hardline. Enemies taking Bravo. Hostile airstrike near your location. We've secured two objectives. Ah, damn it. Yeah, I think the riot shields they need to move half as fast. 
Do we say happy boxing? We can't have a boxing day, but we don't like celebrate it. That's that's weird. Happy? Why would you say happy boxing day? That's odd. Again, same fucking sniper, man. <sighs> they need to nerf that a little bit. It's just ridiculous. Two objectives secure. That one's on ice. It's kind of lagging. It's not the stream's not lagging, just the game. They got a. How the hell did they get a VTOL? Really? Well, how? Enemies taking Alpha. Objective Alpha is compromised. Get out of here. PBR, ridiculous. Is Costco open on Christmas? No. Costco closes on holidays. Slight lead, guys. We need to take that position back. That's leggy as hell. Hostile care package deployed. We're taking Charlie. Helicopter and police sirens. Sounds like a wild night, too. Wild night. Did it take me a long time to get platinum guns? Ah, uh, yeah, something like 50 hours or something like that. Maybe there'll be some entertainment for you. That was good. We're losing our Double kill. The enemy took Alpha. They just keep coming around that corner. Eh? We're losing Charlie. Wonder who set up that claymore, eh? That guy probably set Objective up that claim. Charlie is compromised. Take it back. Hostile force strike in the area. Securing a base alpha. Grenade out! Stun grenade out! Our counter UAV is active. Enemies taking Bravo. Bring the UAV on the <sighs> Position. The enemy holds all objectives. Get it. We're taking Charlie. Securing Alpha. Charlie secure. Secure Bravo. Enemies taking Charlie. Oh, well, we got it. No, no, I'm dead. Hmm. 
Oh, and it's been a while. Be sure to like the stream. Subscribing is great. Donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool emotes. It's about to join from the root money thing below the chat. There's also the Patreon option. Find this game, any game, on the Xbox Store. The affiliate link in the video description. And there's the Amazon affiliate link, too. Yeah. Hmm. Fucking flashbangs. Ugh. The enemy holds two objectives. Move on them now. Bravo. Oh, come on. It was SAB again? Yeah. That gun, man. It's basically the equivalent of quickscope, essentially. Apex. Hmm. The fact that Apex is something that Lari is so keen on, I think definitely confirms that Lari is not someone I know. Interesting. That puts the nail in the coffin on that one. Intriguing. Very, very intriguing. Hmm. Yeah, I think next stream we'll probably like, wrap up the battle pass, I assume, or like three away. that corner. The monocle glass on, am I right? Detective work 101. Objective Alpha is compromised. Take it back. We're taking Alpha. When you shoot that? Oh. Titanfall 2? I thought Titanfall 2's multiplayer doesn't work. Did they fix that at some point? Because that's something we've tried to stream a few times. I've gone to go do it and the multiplayer just doesn't function. It's kind of sad Titanfall 2 never really took off. But then again, squeezing it between other shooters was really, really dumb. Don't know why they did that. Oh, God damn it. Hmm. Warfare 2. I mean, that is one we'd like to do at some point. We'll see if that ever happens. Securing objective Charlie. Oh, can't believe we lost that. I thought we did pretty well that match. We're done. Yeah, you never know when Guard Warfare 2 will pop up or something. Oh, no, I don't want to stop matchmaking. Hmm. 50 years? 50 years since what? Guard Warfare 2? You know, a lot of it's it's hard to schedule with the cabin guy and, you know, stuff like that. You'll see, you kind of get what you get sometimes, right? Oh, hey, Liam. Yeah, I hope you have a good one.
200 toys to put together? We'll have a blast with that. Have a blast. Get those toys built, man. Get those toys built. Prisoner Rescue, right on. On Embassy, too? Cool, cool. Should be fun. I wasn't even part of this game. How did we win another? Switching sides. Prisoner rescue. Prisoner rescue. Let's go, team. Hunter one, locate the prisoners and enemies deploy to counter UAV. Watching your six. <laughs> I didn't even see that guy. Oh, he's hiding behind this like plant thing. That's a good little spot. That's actually a really, really good, clever little spot. Hmm. The campaign in this game? Oh yeah, the campaign was really bad. I I really thought it was quite weak. You know, some people wondering why this wasn't like in my top ten. It's like the story was so blech. Yeah, still haven't done a written review. Hope to at some point, but yeah, I've just been lazy. Lazy and lazy. We're busy. Could be a combination. Prisoner rescue. Bridge back to Hunter One. Expo point marked. Extract all prisoners. Oh crap, where the hell did that person come from? Are they heard reviving someone in the bathroom? Merry Christmas indeed. Best Christmas game? What about that time the Saints saved Christmas? Oh jeez. <sighs> Build a bike, an outdoor playhouse, and then Lego? Christ, you're, you're gonna be really busy, Liam. You're, you're gonna have a whole freaking busy work of work day for you, Ed, man. Damn. That's a lot. That's a lot, a lot. We lost that round. Stand by for the next one. I'm taking fire. Switching sides. Prisoner rescue. Hunter one threats incoming. Keep the prisoner secure. I got jumped in the- oh, and he, he put a mine. Okay, I see what happened. He jumped in, placed a mine, ran the other way. I shot him, mine blew up, got him. Okay. Christmas vacation. It's the quintessential Christmas film. Yes, it is. Ho, ho, ho. Full show. Can this guy get the job done? We're trying to match this, like, just lost, lost. 
15 Xbox cards inside. Well, I hope you enjoy this. Hmm. I mean, we always get a strange bunch in here, I gotta say. Just always a strange bunch. That's what keeps things fresh, though. Hmm. Not a good match to join into. What was an on rail shooter thing? Die Hard? Interesting. Alright, let's see what we get here, guys. What's on the menu of death tonight? Hard point, okay, yeah. On shipment. Not shipness? What is this? This ain't festive. I don't know if I've had shipment actually come up in regular rotation yet. That's weird. That's really, really weird. Hmm. Alright, well, let's do it, guys. Shipment and regular rotation. What a time to be alive. Let's do this. I am 100% focused, as you can tell. Toy, joyous toys. I was like, why are none of these guys die? I'm not used to the action of shipment. My thing is, why didn't they release shipment first, then shoot house, and then do shipment for Christmas, right? It's weird. It's like, you gave us shipment for like three days, and all of a sudden, it's like the Christmas version. Huh? That guy should have died. Again, uh, it's something I want to read into before switching it from competitive to casual to see what it actually does. Ah, oh, I'm gonna get out of the shotgun switch. I guess not. Sometimes I don't even know what's going on on ship. Like, I can't even like, really respond to all the crazy things going on. What the hell was that guy doing? Hmm. What? 
favorite version of shipment. Um, uh, yeah, the original shipment is the, is my favorite. There's been a lot of versions of it throughout the years. A lot of versions. Chopper gunner. Really, man, you gotta put a drone out while you hide in this little area. That's gonna get me killed. I wanna see if I can push for that gunship. See them spawning, but they're not coming this way. There's the gunship. Juggernaut? Ah, spawn behind me. Ah, hey, let's, let's go deliver this. Okay, if I can do this before dying when I spawn. Yeah. Literally can't live long enough to click a couple buttons on my tablet. Oh, here we go. I usually like to do the chopper gunner and then the gunship, but okay. I feel like it's harder nowadays to use the gunship on this one. Maybe it's the spawn protection? I don't know. Helicopter time. I feel like they don't really let you wail on people like they used to, eh? That was a pretty good run. It was a very, very good run. your name's captain, I don't think that impacts the game at all. Your name's captain. Yeah, I don't think it has any impact on the game. I ran out of ammo because there's too many people to kill. Ain't that a weird situation. Uh. 
Wasn't even trying to shoot freaking little electric thing just shooting for me, eh? It actually kind of helps me out. I don't know if people, if that's like the intended thing of those electric shocks, but it usually actually helps me kill someone. Because I'm like shooting when I'm not meant to be shooting, but yeah. I guess gets in the way. At least that's what I've noticed. Yeah. I am indeed rocking them like a hurricane. How's that guy not dying? He's like lying down there now, like shooting bullet after bullet, getting hit marker after hit marker on that dude. Oh, it's the riot shield, okay. That makes sense. I don't even know what's going on in the circle. Like, I, I literally don't even know. It's just shots, shots, shots. Yeah, I don't think the museum's coming back. I think it's the end of it. It's not the end of you guys liking the stream. What? Like, what is even freaking going on on some of these hills? I, I spawned into my own grenade? Okay, lovely. Why do they get really, really frantic suddenly? It's because the score is close, or what? Who would have come back already? Well, I mean, yeah, they probably would have figured out the licensing by now, but uh, who knows? Maybe just randomly one day it'll be there. They'll be like, we did it, guys. I don't like how chaotic this endgame got. Feels like it got crazier at the end here, am I right? Like, I had a really great match, and it was like, the guy was just like, freaking nuts. Like, too nuts. Like, what is even going on? That was that was insane. Did I go positive that match? I didn't even...
I'm gonna go back to the naughty list. Is there like a thing to see last match? Oh. Alright, I went positive. Good, because I was gonna be like, if I did that match, that'd be crazy. <sighs> the trophy system's OP? I mean, you have a thing that can, like, block all grenades? Yeah, it's, it's always been OP. I get why it exists, but it's always been a little ridiculous. All right, let's go, team. It's time for ship miss. Hard point. Cause this is hit news. Do 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 do. <laughs> Unbelievable. I do find this version of shipment a little easier to see in though, because of like the lights and that. It's actually the probably better lit version of the two. If that makes sense. You know what I mean? Not the SAB. There's too many people to shoot at. <laughs> like, there's literally too many people there. Way too many people. Yes, it's always slacks here. Am I done Mirror's Edge Catalyst? I, I do have a video on it, yeah. There's Mirror's Edge Catalyst being covered. usually. Too 
It's literally too much sometimes in the match. In this map. That gun is way overpowered. That SAV is just ridiculous. That guy is cheating. You see how his gun is like auto? Yeah, no, that's, that's cheating. There's, there's no way you're locking on like that with that gun. I know it's like pretty lock on, but it's, it's not like that. That's ridiculous. This is not good, guys. It was going all right, but now it's not going good. SAB and the SPR, just like, it's not even sniping, it's it's literally just like auto-aim instant kills. number requirement. Yeah, a lot of people have issues with that one. I mean, you do pay for this, right? Somebody just lying down there. I remember doing that back in the day, but I don't think they have enough like cover in the middle for you to like lie down in spots anymore. You know what I mean? Like they used to have like little little indents almost that you could cut use this cover in there, but I never got rid of that. Miss any shots at all. It's almost like it aims for him. Yeah, yeah, he's hacking. Or aimbotting, whatever. I can't even highlight him on the other team to report as a player. That's ridiculous. Gotta do it afterwards, I guess. They did kind of miss him, but man, these guns are still ridiculous here with our. Anyways, that's enough of this for tonight. Oh, Yuki, man. Anyways, it was fun. Christmas time. Hope everybody has a good Merry Christmas today.